coming from? I am asking you a question and you're ignoring me. Will you just leave my way? What until you tell me where you've been? For the last time, leave my way now. And if I refuse, what are you going to do? Beat me. Eh? Oh, so you are you're, you're pushing me! Because I am asking the way you're coming from me, don't want to stop me! Wow, baby! You want to beat me, you're going to beat me today! <laughs> <laughs> Daddy, Daddy, what happened? I've been looking for you. Don't cry again, my daughter. I want you to be strong. <laughs> How can I be strong? When you left me alone in this world. No mother. No father. No brother. No sister. Just a wicked uncle and auntie. <laughs> It shall be well with you. Don't cry. <laughs> it makes me sad when I see you cry. Daddy, are you going to stay with me? My daughter, after now you will not see me again. Don't cry. I have to be strong. I'll go. Daddy, please come back. Please come back! <laughs> Vigo, wake up. Your uncle wants to see you. Vigo, wake up. Your uncle wants to see you. Vigo, wake up. He's waiting for you outside. I'm talking to you. Just give me five minutes. You mean he should wait for you for five good minutes before you go and see him? Okay. Uh -huh. Where is she? Can you go for the idiot was just relaxing in the sitting room. I told her that you are calling her. You know what she said? Uh -uh. She reluctantly said, I am coming. Eh? When I tried to persuade her, she said that she would come at her own time. Eh? That she would come at her own time? Imagine. Hey, look, that guy should not waste my time, oh. See, if I forget my hand on her face, they will say I'm wicked. If I go in there again, eh? She will get it hot from me. Yes. Support let, her. Let, Support let her. Me. Uh -huh. Uncle, good morning. Come now, Rita, come. Um, you see this car, eh? Go and bring the keys and the documents. I'll be the one using it henceforth. Okay? Go and bring them. Did you not hear what he said? He said you should go in there, bring the car key and the documents immediately. Rita, Uncle, didn't you hear what I said? Uncle, I was still talking about this. I don't understand why he said I should give you the car keys. This car belongs to my late father. Huh? Yeah. Your late father indeed. Mbano, since it belongs to your father, let him come out from the grave and start driving it. Uh -huh. Because I don't see where dead people drive cars. Oh. Look, don't get me angry. Go and bring the, the, the key and the documents. Uncle, there is no way I am handing over my inheritance to you. Hmm? No. You hear what? Who will you? 
Oh, God, welcome. How are you? Fine, sir. You know you've not told me why you brought me out from my office this afternoon. Why are you being too inquisitive? Um, see, Uncle. Kevin, I have been calm all the way from my office up until now. I'm bravo to that. So, can we just go inside? What's happening inside? Come on, come on. Stop being inquisitive. Let's go inside first. Hi, Ma. Hey, how are you, darling? Good afternoon, Ma. Good afternoon, my dear. How are you? I'm fine, Ma. Yes, how are you doing? I'm good, my dear. You're welcome. Thank you, Ma. Kelvin. Mom. Is she the one? Yes, of course. As you can see, she's hmm. the one. Hmm. <clears throat> she's so pretty. Yeah. Thank you, Ma. You're welcome, my dear. Zara, this is my mom, my pretty mom. <laughs> <laughs> I've been telling her about you. Yes, she has. Mom, I'm so happy to meet you. Thank you, darling. She came visiting, and she demanded that she must see you immediately. Oh, Mom, I'm so happy to see you. You're welcome. Mm. I'm so glad to see you too, my dear. You know, Mom, I've been asking him why he was bringing me here, but then he has refused to tell me. Don't mind my son. He's like that. Just like his father. <laughs> He's just like his father. Ah, Kelvin. Mom. <laughs> You're so lucky to have found such a pretty one. Mom, Mom. She's the one who is lucky to have found someone like me. Jealousy will not kill me. Jealousy is the truth. It's okay. Both of you are lucky to have found each other. Mm -hmm. Now you're talking. <laughs> now you're talking. Oh my god. Okay, welcome, darling. Let's go out. Um, something for you to eat. Hmm? Can I visit the door? Mommy, let's make something for you. Yes, yeah. <laughs> mm Oh. I have not seen her since morning. I have not seen her. Are you sure she's not in her room? She is not there. Her door is locked up, and there is no sign of her anywhere in this house. But wait, wait, what of the key to my brother's house in the city? Did she take it away with her? I don't know. Eh? But I did not see that key. I've searched everywhere. I did not see it. I told you since to seize it from her. You refused. Who knows whether she have gone to the city to sell the house behind you? Ah, don't go there. She dares not. <laughs> Makachuku, if she tries that thing, eh, I will kill her. Wait until something happens before you do anything. You will kill her. Mbano, oh yeah, you go. go and get me my phone. You will not listen. Give me. Until it becomes late. Mbano, call. Let me see how she will pick the call. Somebody will be telling you something. You will not listen. Eh? Switch off. 
have you seen it? Ah, then I don't tell you. Hey, if she tries it, if that girl touches any of my brother's properties, eh, I will kill her. Let her just try me. What, what, what kind of rubbish is this? Wait for her to do something before you act. Hi, Hi. Every time I will, I will. Procrastination, they say, is the killer of time. <laughs> act! Rita, it's all right. Just try. No need to talk. Let her just try it. This man, eh? I wonder if you are a real man. Eh? Every time, procrastination. I will, I will, I will. You know they reach. What is all this? Huh? Sphere what? Working on. So they equally took my father's car. I woke up this morning and I said to myself, I can't, I can't continue with these people. They can kill me. It's okay. People are really wicked. So all they are after is your father's property. Hmm. I couldn't even believe it myself. Kate, this were people I used to buy expensive gifts for. When my father was alive. And because he's no more, they've decided to turn against me. It's okay. That's human being for you. You took the right decision by leaving them. Let them enjoy. Let them enjoy everything while it lasts. Take it easy on yourself. Okay. Come on. Stop crying. Stop crying. Come on, stop. You don't have to do this to yourself. Okay. Okay. I didn't know you had moved from our area. Thank goodness I called you. Yes. This place is a better place for me. Peter, could you imagine that I was spending close to 2,000 Naira every day for transportation in Lent? Okay. You know, I can't really go back home because I, I can't stay there alone. I know. You can stay here. Feel free to stay here. Make here your home. If you have everything, make yourself comfortable. Okay. It's okay. It's okay. Um, have you eaten something? Let me get you something to eat. Okay. You have to try and eat something. You got something. For me. For real? Yeah. Babe, you didn't tell me about this. Must I tell you everything? This is this is wonderful. The bag is full. <laughs> Babe, this is why I'm always proud of you. Come yes. on, do this. So so proud of you. Mm. I have to do something for mommy. Thank you so much. You've tried. Thank you. Yeah. You just finished the whole boutique. Yeah. Wow. Nah. <laughs> mommy, I'm glad you like them. I do. I more than do. <laughs> So, where is my own? 
nothing. Only for more. This is Basha. Hey. Oh, what is it now? Eh? What is it? Huh? What is it? Did I tell you I will, I will not go to the city? Then why are you delaying? You will go to the city. What are you waiting for? Why don't you go today? Eh? Uh, must I go today? Eh? I plan to go day after tomorrow. I want to use today and tomorrow to, you know, look at some businesses I can make money from and take care of you. Eh? What is it? Businesses. How much do you get from the business you are doing here? A business that pays nothing. Eh? Then, which one is more important now? Going to the city and securing your brother's properties that worth millions of naira and the little business you do here that we don't get little or nothing. Which one is more important? Answer me. Oh, Amaka. Look, this business you say yields little or nothing. It's what I used to take care of you. Look at the way you are glowing. Must you argue? Must you argue with everything in everything that I say? You don't listen to me. That is the problem you have always been having in this house. Had it been you do listen to me, we would not be here arguing this. I told you to get that key from Rita since. But you always procrastinate. Look, no, no. Look, stop question. Okay? That house in the city belongs to my late brother. And by extension, it belongs to me. Rita cannot tamper with it. If she does, I will kill her. Very simple. I kill her. The ah. play. The play. Peter Msegini. Gube, gube, gube. Must you procrastinate everything? Eh? Why don't you act? Prevention is better than cure. What kind of a man are you? Eh? Tell the one cable. Don't insult me. Don't ever try to insult me. You are the one insulting yourself, Abro Nemara. If not that I fought for this car, we would have lost it. Lie. This car is my car. <laughs> I inherited it from my brother. So no. nobody can take it. No, what are you no. saying? Without action. If Rita tampers with any of my late brother's properties, I will kill her. Simple. What no, are you no. talking about? No, no. You are the owner of this car. No, no. Am I not the one that fought for it? Am I not the one? If not for me, would you have gotten this car? Hey, look at you. Look at me. I'm driving a Range Rover Sport. Range Rover Sport. Who fought for it? Eh? Am I not even the one that taught you how to drive? Do you know how to drive? Me. Yes, me. I taught you how to drive. That's why you get out. I'm waiting for you. Jeb, yeah? I'm not mad, Jeb. Because you have lost it. You have lost it. Because look well, you don't even know how to drive. Look well before you punch that car at your back. Look well, oh. Because I know you cannot even take care of it. I'm not here. Most of the time, I'm even ashamed of you. Ashamed of you because you don't act like a man. You always procrastinate. Mchi. Magwarogi taalo. Eman taalo. Eh, Peter. Buy it. You buy it. If I did not ask you to do anything, you will not do it. Eh? Useless man. Woman rapper. Kembalo gime. I am waiting for you. Jaloja, Bata. Agaloja must come back. I am not there, I'm not going anywhere. You must do what I ask you to do. Whatever I tell you is what you will do. In a good girl. I am not there. I am not there. Who is this your friend you keep talking about her wedding? Well, she is a good friend and a colleague at the office. Rita, some girls can be so lucky in this life. Her fiancé Kelvin is a very nice and kind-hearted woman. Have you ever seen a man that loves a woman like him? Seriously speaking. <laughs> Sounds like something to be jealous of. Of course, they are perfect match. They love each other so much. In fact, that's where love lies. Well, love is a beautiful thing. But that's what you mean, right, Priscilla? Hmm. This particular one, they are overright. Really? Yes! Hello, girl. <laughs> Welcome, girl. You shall leave long. What happened? Do you know we were just talking about you? I was actually telling my friend here about you and Kelvin. Are you serious? Yes, isn't that wonderful? It is. Hi. Hi. Um, um, Zara, meet Rita. Rita, meet Zara here. It's a pleasure. Same here. Okay, I went to drop off Kelvin's mom, so I decided to come see you. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. You did well. Okay, let's go inside. What do we offer you? <laughs> Rita! <laughs> What's going on?
of a man is this? Huh? Tell the Woko do far. Woko, walk him ah. get, get, get up from there. Get up! Ah. What kind of nonsense is this now? Eh? This beautiful dream that I was having. They were giving me numbers that I will use for my bets. And you are here, you just woke me up. You are a witch, you are a witch. My hey God, when when I did say, I marry this woman now? Oh. When I say that you don't have anything upstairs, it will look as if I don't know what I'm saying. You are senseless, useless, and stupid. You are senseless. You are stupid. You are foolish. You are everything you just said. Idiot. I wish you back the same. So you are here arresting. Instead of you to dress up and go to the city to possess your possession in Oreba, and you are happy about it. You are not ashamed of yourself. You mean you woke me up from this beautiful sleep? I was dreaming about collecting numbers for my bet. You woke me up because of the city thing? I'm not going again. Come and force me. You're not going again. I am not going again. Why are you making it look as if you're doing me a favor by going to the city to possess your possession? I'm doing you a favor. Yes, I'm doing you a favor. Because the money I will get from my bet is billions in short. How much, what are you doing, the, the car, or what, what are you trying to possess? Who possession are you talking about? A poor dreamer. Your brother left something behind for you. What a lazy man like you cannot make in your entire life. You know you cannot make it. So instead of you to go to the city and possess it, you are here whiling away your time. Wait, so you want that stupid, foolish shooter to claim everything, okay? You call me a lazy man, eh? Are you not a lazy man? You are insulting me. See? There will be no peace for you in this house. No rest for you in this house until you dress up to go to that city. Really? Yes. So you want to force me? I have already forced you. You too, there will be no peace for you. Because a woman who says the husband will not rest, we call it no rest. If there's no peace for me, there's no peace for you. Come and force me. It's a hymn, Is that what you are saying? That is what I have said. What am I? Are you touching me? Come. I will, I will beat you. Go, 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 go. I will beat you. I have beat me. I will beat you. you I will beat you. Go in there so that you go to the. I will beat you. Beat you. I will go for you. Nice place. Yeah. Kevin has money. Your friend must be lucky. More than lucky. Up on that. Kevin loves us so, so much. Let's go ahead. Come in, please. Who do we have here? Mm. Did tell me they're coming? Yeah, that's so good. Welcome. Thank you. Hello. You're hey. welcome. Thank you. Please have a seat. Thank you. So, hi, Kelvin. Kelvin is fine. He just stepped out to the front and we'll show you to send back. Um, why, why, what do I offer you guys? Mm. We have wine, soft drinks, beer, each of you want. To mention both of you, <laughs> um, get us a good wine since this is my friend's first time of coming to your house. Sure, and I will do my best to entertain her. Because I like her, she, she kind of looks cool. Forget that look. <laughs> She's a bad girl. <laughs> Please don't mind kids, that's how she talks. <laughs> but I'm always saying the truth. <laughs> Let me get you something. <laughs> nice interior. <laughs> Kelvin has high face. I, I pray God gives me a man like Kelvin. You know, I would love to meet this your Kelvin, Kelvin, Kelvin. You praised him way too much. That's a fact. Don't worry. You're going to confirm it yourself. Okay. <laughs>
What happened? Hey! What happened? When they say delay is dangerous, my husband will not listen. Have you seen it? Have you seen what happened? If where? Why are you shouting? Why won't I shout? Wait. You can tell me why I will not shout. I talk, you will not listen. It will be as if I talk too much. Stop shouting. I... Is it my fault that they padlocked the gate? No, it is my own fault. It is my fault that they padlocked it. Eh? Had it been you listened to me and came here earlier, all this would not have happened. She would not have run away with the key. If you go here now, you have seen it. You, you blame people too much. Why Everything won't I blame, blame you? Blame, 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 blame. You are, you are always co you are Napoleon Bonaparte. You are, you are always correct. What is your own? Look at it now. Eh? We don't have access to this house again. So, what, what do we do? There's a notice here. Okay. To whom is my concern? This property is my concern. Hey. Hey. What is the meaning of this? Hey, hey, hey. Don't, don't, don't touch it. Ah. What is wrong with you? Can't you see that it's written by a lawyer? See? Barrister Esquire. You do, do you know what Esquire means? If you tell this thing now, he will sue you and they will put you in prison. I will not come to visit you. I'm telling you the truth. So, what are we going to do now? Um, let's go home. Let's go to the village. I will call Rita later. Hmm. Okay. You have to call her now. I said I will call her later. No need of procrastination. Call her now. You must. Call her now. Okay, now. the way you are talking with force, not her now. No, now. Come on, force me now. What is it? Must you do all your things by force? Ah! I beg, I'm going. What is it? Ah. Come back here. Where, where, where do you think you are going? I said, call her now. Call her. This woman, you are climbing the tree more than the leaf. What is this? Eh? Stop this thing, though. Leave me. Peter, act like a man for once. Stop this foolishness. Call her. It's your father that is foolish. Eh? Come, let me warn you. Even though that my father advised me not to beat a woman, eh? <laughs> I would have talked about you a long time ago. Take time, oh. Take time. As if you can beat me. Eh? Eh? Man. Let me tell you. Don't disgrace yourself. See people. Beautiful home. Thank you. Mm. She's Kelvin's pet. <laughs> Kelvin can pet her, eh? Huh. Oh. Let me eat my fucking beef. A man should love his woman more, especially his wife. But to find such quality in a man is rare. You are right, my dear. My husband is different from other men. Mm -hmm. Never seen his type. Like he's so intentional about me. Like he's just too perfect. Avanta, let's come, come, come. Okay. Wash this car for me. Okay. I'll wash it for you, eh? You can wash it. Okay. Me, I be wash a holy. Now waiting at the end my life. I'm washing. I be wash guy. Waiting at the end my life. Yeah, but watch this car finish now. Okay, will dash me. I go use acidic cream. Watch the tire. This ring, man. Hey, if I wash that, man, it go shine like new. Hey, where are you going? Okay, yeah. Okay, let's go. Hey, 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 Good afternoon, Kelvin. How are you? I'm fine. Meet my friend Rita. Hi. Rita, how are you? Oh, babe. Let me get upstairs and uh, freshen up. Okay, I'll go with you. I told you. She's Kelvin's spit. I told you. <laughs> Let it be. I'll join you guys soon. Take your time, dear. Enjoy yourself. I told you. 
Have you seen the guy now? Rita! Oh, he's there. Are you alright? Oh, yes, sure. Okay, I'll, I, was, I was talking about Kelvin. Cute guy. Yes, he is. Oh. Drink up. Eat your turkey. Eat, eat, eat. Get to now, eat. Hi. Rita. Rita in my house. How come? Where has she been all this while? Where is she coming from? How did she get here? How did she come to this place? How? Ah, not now. Not now. Oh my God, how am I going to explain this to Zara? How am I going to explain this? No. Hi. I know. I wasn't talking to anyone. Just talking to myself. Okay. How's your friend done? Yes. Is anything the matter? No, not at all. Do you look worried? No, I'm fine. I'm fine. Come on, I'm good. So, did you miss me today? Mm. Mm. No, I did. Do Are you, you sure? Need to ask. Sure. Yes. So tell me, how do you see Kate's friend? She seems like a nice person, and I like her. Has it been long you met her? Uh, no, I met her for the first time at Kate's place. That's the your mom left for the village. Then this is her first time visiting. How come you're concluding that she's a nice person? Well, I mean, this is the second time you're meeting her. Well, from her disposition, like they say, by their fruit you shall know them. It's okay, I'm kind of a famish right now. So famished. So Can I get something to eat? What do you want to eat? Anything available. Okay. So mm -hmm. give me 10 minutes. That's I'll okay. Eat you. Okay? Get it else I'll eat you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm coming. <laughs> How would I have known that a Kelvin Kate was talking about was the one I know? I never believed I would ever see him again. He has totally changed. He is now a rich man. Um, Rita, Zara called to know if we got a home soon. Rita? Rita? Kate, are you alright? Oh, yes, I am fine. Are you sure it's not about your dad again? I said I'm fine. Okay, since you say you're fine, um, Zara actually called to know if you go home. Okay. Okay. Um. What? They look so good together. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> How long have they been together? How long have they been together? Mm. About two to three years. In fact, this year is making them three years together. Um, why did you ask? No, nothing. Just asking. Three years. Yeah, and a perfect match. So, what do we eat? Talk to me. Ah, I'm gonna change up. I'm too tired and I need to rest. Thank you. 
box. Ah. Amaka, why are you sitting here boiling? And you've not opened the door. Who am I talking to? Am I talking to a deaf and dumb person? Open this door, let me go inside. What is it? Peter, that's my name. I am not opening any door. Why? I said I'm not opening any door until you do the needful. What needful are you talking about? Eh? Please, I don't want your wahala this afternoon. Open this door, let me go inside and rest. Okay. You want us to start, Abby? It's okay, you don't say you want my problem this time. Peter, read my list. I said, read my list very well. I am not going to open any door until you call her. Ask her where she is. Let her come here and hand over the key to your brother's properties to you. Why will you do that? Is it when I die? Is it when you will do that? Call her! Call her before I run! I, 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 I oh got it up! God. I can see that you have lost it. You are the one that have lost it! In fact, you are mad. You are running mad. You are crazy. You are not a man. I'm ashamed of you. I'm ashamed to be called your wife. Because you are not a real man. You are not. I am not a man. Yes. Not a real Prove man. Prove it. What of you? Are you a woman? Prove it. Now you prove to me that you are a woman. Seven good years of marriage in this house. Feeding you, clothing you, taking care of you. Your womb is so polluted that you can't even bear me a child. And you call yourself a woman, you should be ashamed of yourself. Idiot! Don't put your mouth to say that I'm not a real man. I don't know if Peter. That's my name. Are you the one saying this to me? Oh, yes, I am. I thought you said you loved me. Are you indirectly calling me a barren woman now because I've been unable to give you children? That is what you are. Is it my fault? Is it my fault that I've not given you any child? No, 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 no. Come to think of it, Peter. Is it my fault? Did you implant anything in my womb and I refused to bring it out as a baby to you? Those women that have children, is it not their husbands that implant something into their wombs for them to conceive and give them children? Is it my fault? You are very wicked. You are very heartless. You are not a man. Yes. I'm wicked. Yes. You are saying you are not barren. If you are not barren, all the things have been deposited inside you. Where did you keep them? Do you, okay, when we finish, you go to somewhere, and remove them, or you take them to Kovu. Idiot! You are supposed to give birth to children with this I'm depositing in you. Now you are here talking nonsense. Are you not barren? What did you do? You talk of love. You? What is love? Look, in a marriage, eh? Love must be complemented with children. Children! So when children now go join with love, then the marriage is consolidated. Not you coming here to say, I love, love, love. Look, love is not blind, though. If you use the right microscope, you will see the color of love. Give me children, real children. How can I give Yo. you children? Peter, tell me, how can I give you children? By getting Is pregnant. Is those water things you are depositing inside of me? Oh. Those water things that don't have weight, does not have weight. Other men deposit big things that can be able to form babies into their women's womb for them to can, conceive can, can you and give them that you children. Are confessing? You give me smelly can you see that you are confessing? How do you know that it's watery? So each time I put it inside you, you can't bring it out. Then you check whether it's watery. Because I give you something solid. Yeah, I know. Solid. I know that it's watery because as soon as you deposit it, yeah. immediately I get up. Pium! It will go up like water. Yeah. Yes. Because you open. For because it, you don't know what to do. You are not a real man. It's all right. Yes. Open this door. Let me go inside. I am not opening any door. Oh, you are not you opening the door. And break it. Okay. I told you that you are not. Doing. I am going outside. Prove yourself. I will go and give those watery things to people who can consolidate them, consolidate okay. the whole thing, and make them children. Woo! Don't blame you. I don't blame you. Woo! Shame on you. Shame on you. Shame on you. Shame on you too. Since all this year. All this plenty, you, you have been playing around with women. How many of them have just gone here to 
I can't even sleep at night anymore. She's always on my mind. Every day and night. Why is she so fast now that I'm about to settle down? I know she loves me, I know. I know she still loves me. Babes, hmm? are you okay? Hmm. You're sorry, it's light headed. Sorry. Yeah, thank you. That's not like you. Why didn't you tell me? I didn't just want to disturb your sleep. When did you start keeping things from me? I'm sorry, babe. Sorry. That's unacceptable. How can I be sleeping and then you are awake? I'm um, so sorry about that, okay? Okay, maybe I should go get you water. Yeah. It's a bit too really hurt. Yeah, give me some water to play. even sleep. I keep thinking about him. Why this? I thought I would never see him again. He was the love of my life. He was everything I had until... Rita, Rita, you're not sleeping. This is one AM. You're not sleeping. What could be bothering you? You've not been yourself in recent time. What could be bothering you? Should I tell her about Kelvin? Rita. Not tonight, I'm fine. You're hiding something from me. I've told you to move on with your life and forget about the past. No amount of worries will bring back your dad. It's okay. I see that I'm fine. Okay. He didn't tell me why your uncle called us after you. I didn't pick his call. Better. So, can we go inside now? 
Just go and sleep. Here is the phone. Where is Luca? Why are you being aggressive? Huh? At least you should respond to my greetings first now. I am not here for your useless greetings. Oh, Peter, my greetings. Yes! Are... I am not here for your useless oh. greetings. Oh, so it's true. It is true that the both of you drove our late brother's daughter out of this house. Eh? Why the reason you ignored our greetings? Yes. Because you are very wicked. Yes! You are very wicked. Amaka. Amaka. I know you are the brain behind this. Stop pushing my brother, Amaka. Stop pushing my brother around. I also heard that you both went to the city. Why are you this wicked? Why? I think I have been respecting you. I have respected you enough because you are my husband's sister. If you insult me again, I will insult you back. Are you mad? You know, Fuala. Why am I giving you see? Do you think I'm Peter, your husband? Eh? Do you think I'm Peter, you push around anyhow you want? Listen, this is my father's house. If you mess around with me, I will send you to where you belong. Nonsense. Elizabeth, how dare you? Huh? How dare you slap my wife right in my presence? What is wrong with you? You don't even have respect? Peter. Peter, if I hear pin again from your mouth. Peter, if I hear pin again from your mouth, I will slap her again. Eh? Yes! I will slap her again. What are you here? What are you here, Peter? Now listen, I am coming back to pull this car. Yes. Wait. To which car? My car. No, no, no. You want to come and tow my car from my compound? Onyoshi. You are not serious. Onyoshi. Is this your car? Is it yours? Thief! Listen. I will tow the car. When I tow it, I will call Rita, the rightful owner of the car. To come and take her late father's car. Mm. It belongs to her. And when I come back and don't find this car, <laughs> I will address the both of you. Nonsense. Yeah. Uh, did she slap you? Is it painful? Oh, I'm sorry about that. You were here, right before you. Your sister slapped me, and you could not even defend me. You are here telling me sorry. Sorry kill you there. You better call her and tell her not to tamper with this car. Else, something will happen. You see. And that is why you have to slap me. Eh? Lizzie slapped you. You couldn't slap her back. You couldn't fight her. If it is me, you'll be behaving like lion, lion, lion. You see yourself? Lazy thing! This woman slapped you. Look, if not that my father told me not to be a pretty woman, eh? I would have given you a back out. What is it? Anyway. My friend, what are you doing in my house? You know, I think that question should be for you. <laughs> okay, see, so you know what is good for you? Just go in there, pack your things, and leave. <laughs> You're kidding, right? You are the one to leave. Because I was here before you. Liar. You are a big liar. Kevin is mine. And I will not allow another woman to take him from me. 
So if you know what is good for you, just go there. Pack your things, else I will push you myself. If you are as little as lay a finger close to my body, I will deal with you ruthlessly. Okay, ma. If you don't want me to push you, leave honorably. You stupid. Huh? Are you stupid? Hey. Did you just love me? <laughs> What is going on here? Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. What is it? <gasps> Baby, she slapped me and said that I should leave the house. What? Oh no. What has come over you? <laughs> I, I, I didn't touch her. I did not touch her. Hey, 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 you shut up. You liar. Why are you lying? Do you know what? Do not make me do throw you out of this house. Baby, she doesn't belong here. Just throw her out. Did you hear that? Huh? <laughs> you do not belong here anymore. So you just have to leave this house. Why are you treating me like this because of this stranger? Hey, don't beg me anything. Hello. Don't beg me. I am no stranger. I was here before you. Now leave before I throw you out myself. Look, I know your plans, but it will not work. Are you, are you actually talking back at my wife? Are you mad? Me. Huh? Hey, my friend, I'm talking to you. Come on, get out. That's are you my mad? Husband. Are you stupid? Now, go in there, pack your things, and leave this house oh, this minute. No, 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 baby. Let her just go from there. Just move. I don't want to see you again if I come back here. Do you hear that? <laughs> this is a get away walk. What's your problem? Why are you not picking your calls? Twenty missed calls. Yes, twenty missed calls. I didn't know my phone was ringing. It was in silence. Eh. And Kelvin called. I'm sorry. You have a phone. It is always in your bag. What is it called? Handset, not bag set. No. So you always hold it because somebody's worried. How can I be calling you? 20 missed calls, you're not picking any one. What do you think? I, what, how do you think I'll feel? Mama, did anything happen? I only tell you that when you tell me why you're here. Well, I can't spend the weekend with my mother. Is it a crime? It's not a crime. Mm -hmm. Next time, don't keep me waiting. I don't like it. I'm sorry. Always hold this your phone in your hand. See, look, look at me. I'm holding my own because it's called handset, not bag set. Not bag, bag set, please. Hand <laughs> the bag. Let's okay. go inside. <laughs> I don't want to laugh. Don't, don't, don't give me that. Let's go. I said, I'm sorry. <laughs> I don't like this. Laugh. I don't like this. Laugh. It's your fault. I don't like this. I will call you. Call, 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 call. You're not big call. If I get a question, I'll tell you.
He used to love me and treat me like a princess. He was so fond of me. Now, he has transferred all the love to another woman. Back then, he had nothing. But today, he is a rich man. My dad cost it all. <sighs> Still feels like yesterday. Your father is a big guy, you know. No, my father is like that. I mean, I like got taste. <laughs> Thank you. to see you. He came to see me. About what? By the way, young man, what kind of friend are you? Daddy, can you at least allow him in so he can tell you himself? I asked the question, Rita. What kind of friend is he to you? He wants to marry me. What? Rita, get inside the house. Dad. You had me right. Get inside the house. Have I not warned you to stay away from boys? Because they are going to ruin your life. Daddy, Kelvin is not that kind of a man. He loves me and I love him too. Love? I said get inside the house this minute. Young man. So, what are you still doing? Um, alright. Leave my house this minute. Uh. Rita, get inside the house. This is how you go about the seven years. Tomorrow you impregnate her and disappear. Come on, get away from my house. This is born. You can force a house to the river, but cannot force it to drink. You can fight within your powers, but what will be, will be. You cannot break a bond that is so strong. Why are you doing this to me? Keep quiet. I said, keep quiet. Do you think I will be alive and watch a good for nothing go dig and mess up my daughter's life? He loves me. Shut your mouth up. What do you know about love? Rita, I don't want to see that young man in my house. Daddy, please don't do this to me. So you are still talking? Give me your phone. I said give me your phone. <laughs> Get the phone. I said give me the phone. Give me the phone. I'm going to change your mind. Let me see how you are going to contact the young man. Daddy. My dad kept me indoors for one whole month. By the time I went to check up on Kelvin, he has gone for he had ended his service at that time. I didn't know I would ever meet him again. Babe, what's up? I am fine. Huh? You with us, your book. I like this book so much. Too. Anyways, I would like to have a glance of it. Uh, no, I, I'll, I'll give you later. I'm still making use of it. Later. Let me just see the synopsis. That's all. I'll give you back. Mm. Bring this book, Jerry. Give me. I don't want her to see that picture. 
was full of vegetables for chili and all certain types. Really, this is beautiful. This is a good one. Ah, have it. I'd like to read after you. No problem. I'll give you later. Are you sure? Yeah, don't fail me. All right. Your friend Zara, have you heard from her? Oh, Zara. She actually traveled to see her mom. I see you later. Let me get something. I want you to tell me the truth. Mm -hmm. Are you having any problems with Gary? No, we are fine. You are what? We are fine. You are shocked. Sure? Pia, don't lie to me. I am your mother. Talk to me. Are you having any problem with Gary? Are you sure everything is okay? No, no, I'm not, I'm not lying. We are fine. We don't have any problem. Okay, I am telling you this because of the dream I had. And I'm very sure Kevin is seeing another woman. Mom, you and I know Kelvin is not a womanizer. He is faithful to me just as I am to him. Agreed. Kevin is a good man. <laughs> that does not stop me from sleeping around. Yes. So I want you to open your eyes, shine them very well and look at things deeply to find out exactly if something is going on. No. I am sure Kevin is not having an affair with any woman. I am the only woman in his life. I'm telling you now you are shocked. You are opening your eyes. You don't want to listen to your mother. Men are polygamous in nature. Do you understand that? So they can play around. I am now calling your attention to it so that before it starts, you stop it. You are looking at me and you are shining your eyes. Mom, I have confidence in you. You cannot disappoint me. Really? No problem. Have you called your uncle to discuss that thing you said to your daddy? That's one of the reasons I came back. I'll go to his house to get the list. I have told you, open your eyes. Kevin is seeing another woman. Mom, you know Kevin loves me so much. I can't even bring myself to go ask him if he's seen another woman. Tell him about the dream that I had. Mom, I don't think there's any need for that. You see? You see? What did you say? I dare you to repeat it. I'm warning you now. You are start, You are singing. You are singing. You are scratching your mouth. Pa, 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 pa. Good. Okay. Pick two. Hmm? I said pick two. What is it? Are you not playing again? I want to ask you something. Okay, go ahead. Let's assume you're in a relationship. Mm -hmm. And you both love each other so much. Mm -hmm. Then something happened along the line that separated you both. Mm -hmm. Sometime again, you run into each other. But you realize that but at that point he's now engaged to another girl. But you still love him. What will you do? What will I do? This is so deep. This is deep. Where is this coming from? Is it a life experience or what? No, 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 no. I saw it on Facebook and people were giving their different opinions. So I just wanted to know what you had to say. Well, my honest answer to this question is 
if I love the guy so much. It will be difficult for me to give up. In other words, she won't give up. Something like that. So can we continue now? Big two. Big two. Good. Yes, coming. Good morning, Mr. Kelby. Good morning, Rita. How did you find here? I asked, and I was told. Can I have a seat? Oh, I'm not welcome. All right, I'll leave. It's okay. I, I I didn't ask you to leave. Okay, please sit. It's not the best thing to offer you guests to sit. Rita, please sit down. I came to ask you why you abandoned me. I did not abandon you. Have you forgotten how your father humiliated me? Humiliate father? Humiliate? Is he dead now? Yes. Oh. He died early this year of cardiac arrest. Oh. I'm so sorry about that. Thank you. I never knew I would ever see you again. Same here. So why did you run away from me? I thought you said you loved me. We don't know what us to start that now. That's, that was in the past, please. Is that what you think? Everything cannot be in the past. Because I know you still love me. I can see the fire burning in your eyes. I still love you, Kelvin. How can you not see everything is in the past? Please, we just have to Stop this now, okay? I have someone I'm engaged with. You have to reverse it. I have never known any other man after you. It's been only you, Kelvin. Remember your promise to me the night you took my virginity? Kelvin. I have not known any other man after that night. Tea today. Is that not enough reason for you to trust me? I'll call her back later. I should leave now. Why? 
why? I'm disturbing. Shouldn't have come in the first place. Oh, Rita, Rita, hold on. Rita, you know how much I loved you then. You still love me. I see your eyes. The sensation is crystal clear. I want you to understand that I have someone else in my life now. So what happens to me now? You left me for another thing. And you expect me to be happy? I shouldn't have really come in the first place. But I tell you... Rita. I understand how you feel. You do not understand how I feel. You know what? I can see how soft you are. Have a nice day. Zara, you sounded so upset on the phone. And you look worried. Is everything all right? Hey, Kate. I don't know why I suddenly became bothered about this. Do you think Kelvin is having an affair with another woman? Are you the one asking this question, Zara? I don't know why, but I am afraid of losing Kelvin to another woman. Where is this coming from? For you to sound like this, there must be something. Okay. I visited my mother. Mm -hmm. So she told me about a scary dream she had. She said in that dream, a woman chased me out of Kelvin's house. No, she said it was Kelvin who chased me out of his house because of that woman. God forbid. Is that why you're panicking? Because of a mere dream. Eh? That was what I said. Not until she started telling me things I could never have imagined in my life. Because she took the dream serious. So what did she say? She said Kevin might be cheating on me, but then I would never find out. So she suggested I, I look into it before it's late. Huh. Zara, listen. I've known you and Kelvin for a very long time. Kelvin is a very responsible man and he cannot play with you. I know. I know Kelvin loves me so much. But the mere thought of Kelvin having an affair with another woman got me jittering. Huh. Zara. 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 How many times did I just call you? Kelvin can never cheat on you. Kelvin can never cheat on you. I can vouch for him to any level. To anywhere you take me to, I will vouch for him. Mm -hmm. What is all this now? Take it easy on yourself. Just have it at the back of your mind that Kelvin can never cheat on you. Know this and know this. Babe, what is it? Why are you so silent? What is the problem? It's nothing. You can't say nothing when you're moody. Okay. Talk to me, what is it? I'm not okay. Now, what is wrong with you? You. Me? Yes. Me. Me, how? What, what did I do? Look, no, babe. Please don't be angry, okay? So, again, listen. I want to ask you a question, okay? Please don't be angry. Okay. Just tell me the truth. I... I'm listening. I. I... Are you seeing another woman? 
What kind of question is that? So you don't even trust me? No, it's not like I don't trust you. I, I, I trust you completely. It's just because just of the, the, the nightmare I had last night. Oh, because of a mere dream that you're doubting me. Oh, I don't even trust me. Mm. Babes, I, try, I trust you completely, 100%. It's just that I'm scared. I'm scared of losing you to another woman. You're scared of losing me when we are going to get married. You're scared of losing me? Ah, I, I feel betrayed now. I'm sorry, okay? I'm, I'm sorry I asked. Just, just forget I asked, okay? I'm sorry. It's okay, it's okay. It's okay. I, 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 can, I, can, I can now see the kind of love you have for me. You don't even trust me. You're even doubting me. No love, no trust. You don't even believe in me. It's okay. Taking your call. Is it, is it not this guy? Eh? He wants to borrow money from me. But I told him I cannot do it, that he cannot work. Eh? And he keeps calling me. You can imagine. Oh, people, people. So come on, they come to ask me for money. Okay. I know it's because of her. It is because of that girl he's not picking my calls. Kelvin, there is no way I'm going to allow you to marry her. I gave you my virginity. And there is no way I'm going to allow you to marry another woman. No. No other woman will take my place in your house. Never! Rita, who are you talking to? I was talking to myself. You are talking to yourself. Rita, you are acting strange these days. Kate, you won't understand. I won't understand. Rita, you are keeping something away from me. But it is well. Since you don't want to tell me about it, no problem. I'm sorry. See, the thing is, I don't want to bother with my problems. I can fix it. You can fix it. Good luck. Are you angry? No, I don't let me angry. I'm not too. You can force a house to the river, but cannot force it to drink. You can fight within your powers, but what will be will be. You cannot break. You're going to cancel this one, huh? Then add it with the other one I told you before. Yes, sir. Yes. Then um, this one again. Come closer, come closer. Look at this one, huh? Right. Okay. Yeah. Welcome. Hey. How are you? You didn't, you didn't tell me you were coming. And uh, for that, I am not welcome. No, normally you call me before you come to the office. I mean, I decided not to call. Is it a crime? It's okay. You can go. Thank you, sir. Yeah. <laughs> Hey, come on, come on, come on. Is this what you bear to work? Kevin, why do you allow such? What are you talking about? Didn't you hear me? 
But how can she wear this skimpy dress to work and you allow it? Um, secretary, please, you can go. Thank you, sir. Thank you, ma'am. Please, don't baby me. What were you doing with her when I walked in? Excuse me, you beg your pardon. What are you talking about? Do you know I trust you, right? Is she the one? Excuse me, you're, you're insulting me. What has come over you? I will not talk to you until you tell me the truth. Zara, Zara, come back here. What is going on? What has come over? What is this? What's the meaning of this? You. So your work here is to seduce my husband and get him to sleep with you, right? Excuse me, ma. What kind of talk is that? I don't want. Does it look like I'm joking with you? Does it look like I do not know what I saw in there? You must be sick in the head. Look, I know what I saw in there. I know you are sleeping with my husband. Are you not sleeping with my husband? Huh? You can't even deny it. Can you? What are you saying, ma? This is an allegation and I'm not going to take it. Oh! It's an allegation. Can't you deny it? Are you not sleeping with my husband? Are you not? You know, you know what? Let me give you this advice for free. Today should be your last day in this office. If I come here tomorrow and I find you here, they will bundle your corpse to your family. I don't trust in people. Oh, shh. What is it? Zara slaps me. Ask me to quit my job or else you kill me. What? When was Zara say a thing like that? She said I'm sleeping with you. It's okay. It's okay. Stop crying, okay? Um, you're not gonna quit your job. Okay? Stop crying. Thank you, Sam. Six three. How are you doing? Today is my day. I'll have my revenge. Hmm, it's not by mouth. Okay. Not by mouth. What did you say? What did you just say? down. Let's continue. Mm. Ah. Let's see. Yeah. Let me see your game now. Are uh, you seeing me? Where is it coming? The hook's up. Can I see you go through? Is anything the matter? It's confidential. Just come to me. Did you have I, I don't know. What? Let me see. I'm coming. Found about me. She didn't even look at me. Okay. Well, 
we have no kids. Everything my mother said is true. I don't understand. What are you saying? I am just coming from Kelvin's office. I caught I caught him almost kissing his secretary. What kind of joke is that? Eh? Nora, please stop it. Eh? The Kelvin I know cannot condescend so low. That is what you think. Do you know Kelvin was angry with me because I didn't inform him before going to his office? Zara, something is wrong somewhere. I, are you sure of what you saw? I know what I saw. Do I look like a child? I saw his secretary leaning towards him when I bashed it. Like I knew something was going on. Gosh. Kelvin, I can't believe this. Kelvin, almost kissing his secretary. You have to believe it. I can't lie to you. My mom said it. She said it, but I, I doubted her because I trusted Kelvin so much. How could Kelvin do this to me? How could he? What have I ever done to Kelvin? What? All I did was, was to be a good girlfriend. I would have been nothing but faithful to Kelvin. How? How could Kelvin do this to Zara? I know Zara cannot lie to me about such a serious matter. Men can be so unpredictable. Ashidwali. Yes. She looks troubled. Is she alright? She's having trouble with Kelvin. Why? She said Kelvin is having an affair with the secretary. How does she know? Kelvin cannot be having an affair with his secretary. He said she caught them almost kissing in his office. No. She's not sure about what she saw. That guy cannot do a thing like that. I told her. But she insisted she knew what she saw. She's right. I'll find out what really happened. What are you thinking? Nothing. I am just angry. Why would he do a thing like that? That's if it's true. The Kelvin I know can never do such a thing. She has refused to pick my calls since she left my office. I really have to find what's going wrong. Something is really wrong that I'm sure of. Where are you? I'm driving. I would like us to see. How do I see you? I'll call you back later. Okay. It's important we see. I'd like us to discuss what happened in the office today. What is she even talking about? Can you hear me? Like I said, I'll call you back later. Okay. I'll be waiting. What does she mean by that? 
I know he's going to be wondering how I figured out what happened in his office. <sighs> this could just be an opportunity for me to take back my Kelvin. I'm looking for you inside. I came to take a stroll. Are you going out? Yes. Zara said I should come over to our place. What happened again? I don't know. Until I get there. Okay. Come back quick. All right. See ya. Uh-uh. Just Zara's house, you are dressed like this. Of course, baby. Hello? <laughs> yeah? What is happening? Why are you crying? Mommy, it has happened. What is it? It must have happened to me. Mom. Mommy, Kevin, Kevin is seeing another woman. How did you know? I, I caught them in his office. It's even embarrassing to say Kevin is having an affair with his secretary. And you're crying. You did cry, we solved the problem. I told you. The other day I was telling you, you were shopping your mouth. Papa, 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 you were thinking. Mommy, of all people, Kevin chose to sleep with. Kevin decided to, 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 to cheat on me with his secretary. Oh, I don't know what to do anymore. How was I supposed to know he's like that? And you were telling me I was insisting that he was a good person, that he wouldn't cheat on me. You better know what to do. You better know what to do. Listen. Listen, listen, listen. Stop this cry. Stop it and listen to me. Have you stopped crying? Good. You will follow the devil. Trace him wherever he goes to. Follow him closely. Mark him very well. If it is true, stop it right now. Do you hear me? Mom, Mom, I feel like killing myself. Eh? What did you say? You feel like killing yourself? If you try it, Kevin will even marry 15. Idiot. You want to kill yourself and allow him go. Follow him, you're thinking of killing yourself. Don't talk rubbish. <laughs> Mommy, he's here. Let me call you back later. Mom, Ophia, you want to kill yourself? Stop this, stop this. have to stop this madness now. Kevin, you said this madness, it's just started. You said that girl, that stupid girl, I will kill her the next time I find her in your office. Oh, you actually asked her to quit her job? Yes, I did. What would you do about it? Beat me. Oh. Kevin, you want to beat me? Babe, babe, please, for the last time, why are you doing this? I cannot stop so low to start sleeping with my secretary. It's not possible. Okay. So what were you doing with her? I was correcting some mistakes that she did while typing my letter for me. Oh wow. Yes. You were correcting some mistakes for what she, she did. And she was so close to you that her lips was almost on your lips. Oh, babe, you are you are insulting me now. Kevin, you insulted yourself. 
You insulted yourself the moment you started sleeping with your secretary. I can't even believe this. Maybe you have to stop this now. Please. Why do you... Why do you want to ruin my life? Why? Kevin, take your call. Kevin. Oh, you don't want to take the call because she's the one who's calling you. Huh? I'm so disappointed in you. Honestly, kids, I would have done something nasty today. If not that I called my mother and then she consoled me. I am yet to believe what you just said. You want us to never thing. Honestly, I made a mistake. I should have strangled that girl. Who is she to sleep with my man? Oh! Is that why you have to take it easy on her? Take it easy on yourself too. I'm not taking anything easy. Kevin must pay for this heartbreak it cost me. Okay. Fine. Where is he now? I don't know. He left not quite long and I don't care. Hmm? Kate. Okay, I'm not sure this marriage is going to work. Don't say that. Don't! You want to let that destroy the relationship you built with Kelvin for so many years? Listen, Zara. That girl is simply a hooker. And the best thing to do is to stop her from working for Kelvin. Do you know Kelvin was mad at me because I told the girl to quit her job? Yes. Plus, he never admitted that he was sleeping with the girl. Zara. The devil is really at work. I don't want you to give room to the devil to destroy your relationship with Kelvin. Please, can you just leave the devil out of this? Kelvin is to be blamed for not controlling himself. A man without self-control is more like a vehicle without brake. Zara, I want you to know one thing. No one is above mistake. No one. Kate, there is nothing like a mistake in this issue. Kevin has been lying to me. He has been deceiving me, saying I am the only woman in his life. Who knows if he also promised the girl marriage? He will do no such thing. Please, can you just stop defending me? It's irritating. My mother said all men are polygamous in nature. But well, I said no. My Kevin is exceptional. He's too upright, he can't do that. My mom has been right all along. Really just stopped us. What do you expect me to say? Tell me! You have to take it easy on yourself. Kelvin, you have really changed. The Kelvin that I used to know back then was never into women. Today, the story is different. Why is it so? What exactly are you talking about? I am talking about what happened in your office this afternoon. You were caught kissing your secretary. True or false? How did she know? You're surprised I'm aware of it. Kelvin, why would you do a thing like that? Whoever that must have told you that lied to you. Okay? 
I wouldn't do a thing like that. Meanwhile, is that is that why you called me out here? What's your main reason of calling me out here? Well, it's not entirely the reason I called to see you. Then let me get the main reason you called me out here. Calvin, can you please just take it easy? Take it easy, baby. It's just that I was sad. I was sad when I heard about the incident. You know, it's quite shameful. The truth is that I didn't, I, I never had anything to do with my secretary. I cannot stop so low to start kissing my secretary in the office. I cannot do that. It's okay. It's okay. I'm sorry if um, I got you a bit upset with the topic. It's all right. So, can we go to somewhere more comfortable to talk? Where do you want us to go? <sighs> I'm new in this area. I don't really know much places here. Would you mind if we go to my friend's hotel? That's fine. Are you okay with that? Yes. It's okay. Let's go then. Yeah. You can force a house to the river, but cannot force it to drink. You can fight within your powers, but what will be? I've been worried about this car. Why are you worried about my car? I have a feeling that your sister might come here one day and carry it. How is that possible? Eh? You worry too much. You mean Lizzie will just come in here, collect this key from me, and take the car away? How possible? See, Calm down. If you will listen to me. It's better we take this car somewhere till Fuda notice. Biko, why are you panicking about nothing? Eh? I'm just panicking for nothing. I'm car. Well, see, this is my car. I should take it from my own compound and go and park it somewhere. How? It is my inheritance. My late brother's car. And I always tell you, by extension, it is my car. I own it. Stop panicking. We are not talking about who has the right or who does not have the right over this car. What we are talking about now is securing this car, making sure that nothing happens to it, that it will still be under our own custody. Biko, Kaibu Pia, you don't know the method she will use to carry it. Which method are you talking about? If she likes so, let her use IU Park nomenclature. Or uh, almighty formula. Or hero's formula, Papa. Completing the squares. Let her use anyone. I am ready. I am telling you, if she comes here, she cannot collect the key not to talk of taking the car away. Stop worrying yourself. Biko. You will not listen to me now. See, eh? I will not forgive you and I will not be happy with you if anything happens to this car. If my fears comes to reality, you can fifa again. Amaka, calm down. Wait to be. Don't worry yourself. I have told you I am waiting for her to come. In fact, you are the one trying to dream her here now. So even if your dreams make her to come, I am waiting. I am hungry. As a matter of fact, I'm famished. Go inside and prepare food for me. I want to eat. Yeah? What is that? You want to eat? Yes. 
<laughs> no food for you until we finalize the issue of this car, mm. securing this car. What are we finalizing again now? Eh? I have told you, let her come. I am waiting. She can't take this car from me. Take it to the bank. Ah. Anaka, give me my car key. What is wrong with this woman? Bring my car key. What's wrong with you? Eh? Why is he not taking his calls? He's been over 30 minutes now and he's not taking any of my calls. This is 9.30. Kevin has never stayed out this late, except I'm with him. Where could he be? And why is he not showing my calls? Kelvin. Where are you coming from? I am asking you a question and you're ignoring me. Will you just leave my way? What until you tell me where you've been? For the last time, leave my way now. And if I refuse, what are you going to do? Beat me. Huh? you to kill me. That is what I want from you. Kevin, what did I do to you to deserve this kind of oh, treatment from you? What? You are disturbing me. Just shut up. I have not even started and you're already complaining. Kevin, you will know no peace in this house until you tell yourself the truth. You should be ashamed of you're, yourself. You're making a hell of noise for God's sake. You're making noise. Kevin, I want you to beat me. Kelvin, I want you to beat me. Beat me, beat me this night. I'm so disappointed in you. Look at who is talking. You are a monumental disappointment. And I promise you, you're going to pay for every pain you've cost me. Beat me. For a shame. This is what I want. I want you to beat me. This is what I want. Kevin, beat me. I'll show you guys. Kevin, beat me. Kill me. That is what I want. Kill me. I take my death. Kill me. Kevin, kill me. Kevin, beat me. I take my dead body to my mother. Kill me. Look at his hand. It's very big like King Kong hand. If I give you something, yeah. If I give you something, then you will die. Kill me. What are you putting ah, for? So disappointed in you. Give me your shit, 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 Give Say, I'm going to be a fool to lay my hands on you. I thought you loved me. Hmm? But thank God you've shown your true color. You're just, you're just, you're just, you're just a waste. What's wrong with you? Thank God you've actually shown your true color. Kelvin, what will you do? Cancel our wedding. Please go ahead and cancel it. I wouldn't have accepted this relationship if I had known that you are a Casanova. A egot. Hmm. You know what? You're going to regret this. I am not going to regret anything. You are the one who is going to regret it. You are the one, Kevin. You are the one who is going to regret it.
has viewed everything. I saw how devastated he was yesterday. I believed him when he said he's not having an affair with his secretary. I know Kelvin more than any other person. Zara must have acted out of ignorance and misconception. He was not happy throughout our stay yesterday. When I see what happened at my friend's hotel, you know, it was too crowded and I don't like it like that. So I decided we'll come back here and then talk. It's quiet here though. It's fine. Okay, you see, it's hot so bad when you shot someone and the person is behaving somehow. Okay? I don't see the reason I should be sleeping with my secretary. You know, that memory will never leave my thought for the rest of my life. I believe you because I know what you can do. It's quite unfortunate she misunderstood what she saw. And that only means one thing. She's been suspecting you. You see, Zara will never display that kind of character. She has not done it before. I think someone somewhere is trying to feed her with some kind of information, which is not good. You could be right. Lorita, you caused it. You left me. You abandoned me because of your father. Have I not told you what happened? I was kept indoors. And you? If I were you, I would have kept visit. I would have been a dead man if I had tried that. What I see, Zara met me when I really need money. But you were there when I had nothing. And I still gave you my virginity, isn't it? You're right. You know, the memories of that night would never leave my thoughts. I really miss you. You broke my heart. And I'll never forgive you for that. You caused it. Your father nearly killed me. Meaning that you cannot lay down your life for the one you love? You're guilty of the same accusation you're laying on me. You would have decided to come out to look for me. Okay, okay, okay. Now you are trying to justify yourself. Kelvin, you are the man. And it's your responsibility to show me that you love me. To prove it to me. Rita, it's okay. You wait. He is still the same Kelvin that I used to know. So gentle and caring. What is it? I'm worried about Zara. The devil is about to destroy her relationship with Kelvin. What is it again this time? She called on the phone just now and was crying that Kelvin came back home very late at night yesterday. He had a date with the secretary and came back home very late. He had a date with his secretary and came back home very late. And that's what Zara said. How did she know he was with his secretary? She said when he asked him where he was coming from that late at night, he didn't say anything to her. He didn't answer her. And because of that, she concluded he was with his secretary? Don't you think she's making a big mistake? 
I don't know. Every time I'm confused. I'm confused with the whole thing that's happening. I I think I think um, Zara have lost it. Seriously. And she said um, Kelvin has even threatened to end their relationship. That is serious. That's why I need to see Kelvin. I think I need to see Kelvin. And tell him what? I, I need to hear his own side of the story. I need to ask him or confirm what Zara has been saying. Like you rightly said, Zara might, might be making a mistake. I don't think seeing Kelvin will make any difference. For me, I think your friend Zara is a problem here. I have to see Kelvin. It's okay, it's okay. I'm gonna do that tomorrow. Yes, yeah, coming. Um, just give me a few minutes, I'll call you back. Yep. Oh, sorry for the disturbance, sir. It's okay, what is it? I brought you this. What is it for? My resignation letter. Your resignation letter? Sir, I told you about the threat I got from your wife. I don't know if you mind. What is wrong with you? You're giving me your resignation letter. And for information, I'm not yet married to her. So stop calling her my wife. Sir, I am the only child of my parents. I don't want anything to happen to me. Uh, please, sir, I can get you another secretary if you want. Do not get me angry, okay? As long as I'm still here, she has no right over anything here, so go back to your seat. Please, sir, try to understand me. My parents asked me to quit. Can I talk with your father? Please, sir, he's of no use. My dad will not listen to you, and even my mom, too. You've been a good boss to me, and I really appreciate it. I need to leave now, please. Thank you, sir. I'll have to leave. Yavike, don't command me any help for my own car. You are talking to a big boy. Ah. No, 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 no. It's 20,000 naira. Do you know how much it cost me to buy fuel? I will spend 15,000 naira on fuel alone. Huh? I know. It's 20,000 naira on nothing. Uh, what is it? Yeah, Peter, back, eh, no? So you are here? Eh? Come to the front now, Biko. Uh, Biko, let, let me call you back, okay? What is it? Eh? Did you see that I was on a call? Whether you are in a call or not is none of my business. I warned you, but you refuse to listen to me. Come to the front and receive your visitors. What are you going to visit us? Which visitors are you talking about? So you want me to answer that question, right? Because I can be asking only answer it. Let me see my local trouble. This woman, she, she just makes a mountain out of a moor hill. Eh? Every trivial matter, she must bring quarry. Just to receive visitors. Quarrel. Ha. This of Banjay, I'm sure Banjay is, is disturbing her. Where is he? Where is your husband? Don't disturb me because your brother is coming. I'm going to stop. Officers, go in there and arrest him. Arrest my, uh, my, my husband. For what? What has he done? That is him. Officers, get him arrested. Get who arrested? Eh? What is going on here? Who do you want them to arrest? What is the problem? You, Peter. Peter, you are a thief. Oh, no, Shikibu, Peter. You are a thief? Yes. How? You are a thief. Mba, give me the car keys. Give me the key to this car. Which car are you talking about? Oh, my car? Eh? Eh? You want me to give you my car keys? How? Your car. They don't own you. 
Did I not warn you? Omega, omega, omega. Oh, yeah, she. <laughs> Look, officers, if it is because of my car that you people came here to make arrest, this is what I call wrong arrest. Mm. Ah, this car belongs to me. As a matter of fact, ah. it was my late brother that left it for me. He died. And I inherited everything I had. How so can you arrest me over my own thing? You're a thief. How can you say it's your car? My brother's car, your car. Uh, uh, Lizzie, why are you doing this? Huh? Officer, why are you doing this? This man is wasting our time. He's wasting our time. Get him arrested. Let him get the car keys. And let's go to the station at once. Uh, Mr. Peter, you are under arrest for unlawful possession. And now you have to cooperate with us. We don't want to use force on you. Where is the key to the car? No, but officer, I don't understand. How can my own thing become an unlawful thing? How can I be in possession of my own thing unlawfully? How is, how what is your thing? You don't Peter know, you don't know where your thing is. Peter, you don't know where your thing is. Peter, this car is not I, yours. I know you are like this. You are a corrupt person. Peter. We are talking of car. You are talking of something. Give them this key. In your hakia. Eh? Money be fool. Never know. Hey, look, you don't have to insult me. You don't have to insult me. Okay. Officers, if this woman see him again, arrest her with her husband. Uh, arrest me for Yes! What? what did I do? I oh, yeah, let them arrest You don't know what you did. Let them for arrest him. Peter. Eh? Yes! For marrying Peter. Oh, yeah, no, let them let arrest him. Arrest. Mr. Peter, can we have the car keys? You are wasting our time, please. Uh, I Get him handcuffed. Eh? Handcuffed? Oh, no, 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 you don't need to handcuff me. I'll, I'll do this. Eh? Give me! What is where? What is where? You want us to, to hack up the oh. Eh? Yeah. I don't want them to. You are wasting Let's go! So you get back the key. Come! Hey, you shut up, you idiot! Hey! Now move. Now move. I said it that you are not move. a man. That you are not a man. Just keep quiet! No, now you move. want them to hack off me? I said move. move. Uh, oh, you are fearing for handcuffs. Come on, be a man now. Mr. Mamu! Come down, come down, come down. Let's go like that. I want them to hack off me. I said it! Hey! Hey! A man that cannot act like a man. What is he? Woman rapper? Okay. Useless man. Senseless man. Foolish man. Shameless man. That is what you are. I know of you. Hey! The only property that we got from the late chief is now gone. I have all this Aka. Hey! All my sufferings, all my efforts is now useless. Hey! Peter, you must pay for this. You must pay for this! How can you reap what you did not sow? How can you claim what does not... I've never been embarrassed and humiliated in my life. You can imagine someone like Zara accusing me of sleeping with my secretary even to an extent of threatening my secretary to resign. And she resigned this morning. I'm left alone here without a secretary. You can imagine. Oh, no, this one time, really. seriously. Well, I tried talking to Zara about it, but she kept her ground that she's sleeping with the secretary. I think I am. Um, Done. I can't continue with such a relationship. I am done with this relationship. I, I, I mean, I've come to an end of this. Don't, don't say that, please. Don't say that. I, I, I know too well that Zara made a mistake. I'm pleading with you to please give her some time. She will definitely realize her mistake. I cannot be having anything to do with someone who doesn't trust me. Zara has actually betrayed the trust I have for her. She has betrayed the trust. You betrayed yourself, my daughter did not betray you. Yes, would it have happened if you were not caught kissing your secretary in this office? Mama, don't say that. You've not heard from him. What are you saying? That Zara is a fool or she does not know what she's saying? Mama, that's not what I said. Mama, there's a problem on the ground. All we need to is how to settle this problem so that there will be peace. What kind of peace are you talking about? How would you feel if you were my daughter? He's here telling you that my daughter betrayed him. Why is he the one that betrayed my daughter? Mama. Will you shut up? Shut it up because I'm not here for you. 
He has mouth, let him speak for himself. Yeah? I hope it's not what I'm thinking. I know you have to answer. What are you doing here? I hope you're not having an affair with your friend's fiance. Mama, please! What are you doing in your friend's fiance's place? I want to know. Answer me. Um, Kelvin, I, I think I, I need to go now. I really have to go. To where? So where? Where are you going? You have to explain to my daughter what you are doing in Afghanistan's office. Mama, I, no problem. I can't see it. Where I, are you I, going? It's a question. Mama, I, I have to go now. I you have, have to I'm go. I'm going to my office. Now. Sorry, Mama. Happy and wait. No matter the challenges and obstructions. Lord have mercy. What we be will be. 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 So why plan evil for a harmless fellow? Yes, mom. Kate, mom, are you serious? Okay. Mom, I read you. Mom, I'll call you back. Kate is not even on my side. Hey, hey, my jam! If you're coming here because you want to tell me how you insulted my mother at my husband's office, well, you need to do a U-turn and go back to your house because she already told me what happened. I thought you have sense. Did you just call me senseless? You can give me whatever interpretation you want. So you actually sent your mother to go and insult Kevin. Instead of being on the side of settlement, right? Now what stupid settlement are you talking about? Is that why you insulted my mother over a matter that is not even yours? Is that all you have to say? Yes, I am so, so disappointed in you. I thought you were my friend. But you are busy stabbing me at the back and pretending to be a good person. You are the one who has disappointed yourself by allowing your mother to cause a rift between you and the man who is supposed to marry you. Let me tell you one thing. I will learn to mind my business from today onward. Fine! I can handle this situation all by myself. You don't, I don't need your assistance. Good luck, my good friend. Go! Good luck. And if you think this is the end between me and Kelvin's relationship, then you're, you're making a mistake. Because I am going to fight tooth and nail to get my man back. End your problems, bastards! You come and act all nice in front of me and then you stab me at the back. Rubbish! <sighs> Zara and her mother have really shown me their true color. I'm happy all this are happening now. This is a clear sign that Zara is not my wife. Thank God I found my true love. A woman who loves me with all her heart. Who loves me for who I am and not what I am. She has never betrayed my trust in her. That is the kind of woman I want to spend the rest of my life with. Mm. Yeah. You can force a house to the river but cannot force it to drink. You can fight within your powers but what will be will be you cannot break a bond that is so strong a bond built in true love a bond built in true love i've never been embarrassed like this in my life do you know that her mother accused me of sleeping with kelvin too are you serious i am telling you the truth Kelvin could not say a word. The woman was just ranting and ranting. Then she must be the one misleading her daughter. She is, because she even calls Zara immediately to tell her that I was insulting her and abusing her. By the time I got to Kelvin's house, Zara was already waiting to attack me. Did she? 
She belittled me. She gave me the highest insult of my life. Is she with her senses? Why would she attack you for trying to settle issues between she and Kelvin? And I regret going to that office. And I told her that she will, she will regret her action. She will live to regret that action. The action she took towards me, she will live to regret it. No, 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 no. No. She didn't get it right. Who then will stand for her? Who else? Her mother. She will definitely stand for her. Kate. Do you think Kelvin will end the relationship between him and Zara because of this? I don't know. Because I don't care anymore. Whatever Zara sees in that relationship, let her take it. She's on fire. I need to get. No, mom. He's not yet back. Mom, I told you, don't worry yourself about Kevin. I can handle the situation. Hey, but hey, 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 listen to me, listen to me. Pack your things and leave this house. And you have 30 minutes to do that. Do you hear me? Do you get that? And what if I refuse? You have no choice, my dear. Since you have the guts to tell your mother to come to my office, to insult me, I am done with you. Kevin, you lie. Oh, so you think you can just toss me out like some piece of trash because of that whore you call a secretary, right? Hey, 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 listen. And listen good. Pack your things and leave this house. And your 30 minutes start counting from now. Kevin, I am going nowhere. You have not had anything. I am going nowhere. Or you think throwing me out will be that easy for you? Then you need to have a rethink. Don't push me. Kevin, I think it's high time I tell your mother what is going on. Do not push me. Pack your things and leave my house. You're not yet my wife. So calling my mother will not change my mind. I warn you. Let's watch and see how you I touched you. that phone, I'll just splash it on the floor. I'm even helping you back in the clothes. So it will be easier for you. If I touch that phone, I'll smash it on the floor. Don't joke with me, yo. Mommy, as you refused to take the phone from me. Okay, ma. If you want, call my mom from now to next millennium. Huh? You must leave this house. You must leave this house. Then you will have to bond me out of this place. Give me that phone. For what? Hello, Mom. Uh, Mom? Yes, I'm very busy now. I'll call you back. I'll call you back. Don't, don't touch any of my things, oh. Don't touch any of my things. If you don't leave my way, eh? I'm going to break you into pieces. Do you understand? Hey, just tell me that you want to kill me! Tell me that you want to kill me! I tell my, I tell my, I'm going to my cops to my mother! Tell me that you want to kill me! Just kill me! Just say you want to kill me! Kill me that you want to my cops! I can't take it to my mother! I'm not going anywhere! I'm not going anywhere! Who am I carrying me? Who am I carrying me? Who am I carrying me? I'm not going anywhere! Who am I carrying me? Hello, Mom. Yes, I'm going to somewhere. 
Mom, if I return and see her in that house, it's going to be something else. Mommy, it's nothing. That one is nothing. It's just three years relationship. It's just three years relationship and I'm done with that. Um, Zara is not a wife material. She was only pretending. Okay? She was just only pretending. Mom? Yeah. You can force us to the river, but cannot force it to drink. You can fight within your powers, but what will be? You, but you wouldn't listen. Oh my God, Hey, you see this thing, eh? Hmm? Lizzie will not go scot free. I must deal with her. Eh? She, she cannot get that cow. That cow, she will never get it. Okay. Empty threats. Eh? You're just making useless noise. More. Empty threat, useless noise. Do you know what they did to me in that police cell? Eh? Small boys, oh, rastichi. They were giving me upper court. Upper court. Imagine one small one. They said that one is, is your guy. That one, he, he, he asked me to, to be funny him like this, funny him like this. Can you imagine? Hmm? In fact, eh, this thing that Lizzie did, eh? no, 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 no. I will so deal with her. Diko. I did not say you should not with her yet. Before you do that, you have to give me my money first. Because I want you. Money? Which money are you talking about? Can you which money am I talking about? The 5,000 I used to bail you. 5,000? You mean you carry the whole 5,000 naira to give to police in Nigeria? You don't know that bail is free? This but the general police has said it that police is your friend. So bail is free. Why would you go and pay money to bail me? Eh? They owe five thousand naira. After you say you don't have money, you are laughing. You know why I'm laughing. I just want to laugh because I don't want to vent my angers on you. You know yeah? Just give me that five thousand naira before I lose it. You, you you see yourself your angers. So it's not even one anger you have for me. You have plenty angers for me. But did I ask you to, 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 to spend money to bail me? Did you take permission from me? Don't ask me for money. Oh. Peter! Peter! That's my name. See, if you don't give me that 5,000 naira today, you will see the other side. You of can't me. do anything. You're my wife. Wait, what are you going to do to me that they didn't do to me in the cell? You're my wife. You're threatening me. My friend, go inside and boil water so that you can massage myself. Yaku, yaku, yaku. All the places that are done, join, go join. I cannot release them with you. What are you talking? My friend, go, go and boil water. <laughs> it is not only massaging you. Know. I will sing you la bite to you. I like singing. Go. Oh. Eh? Me, I don't fear. You go and watch him. Go and Look at this woman, oh. You, just, you are just misbehaving. Me, your husband, I pay. Okay, don't worry. Don't worry. At night, don't come and do your duties to straighten me up. Then you will know that I am Peter. Eh? Idiot. If I hear you, you are read yours. How can you read what you did not sow? How can you claim what does not belong to you? Hey, greediness first, then destruction follows. Come out your eye of a waiting, no be your owner. Evil people everywhere. Hey, wicked people everywhere. They're trolling like hungry wolves. Attacking the innocent by evil people everywhere. No, mom, he's not yet back. Yeah, I need him to now. Thank you, mom. No problem. And what are you still doing here? I thought I told you I do not want to see you when I come back here. What are you still doing in my house? And I remember telling you that I am not going anywhere. Hmm. Zara, you're pushing me. You're pushing me. When I will react, you might not like it. You might not like it. You better carry your things and leave my house. 
I am not going anywhere. So after climbing me up and down, you want to throw me away? And I paid you for climbing you up and down. I paid you. I took care of you and your family and all the things I did for you in the past. So stop talking rubbish. Leave this house before it's too late. Kelvin, you must want this relationship. Okay, you want to try me, right? You have to kill me. That's the only way you can kill me. Then you will die. Then I am going to kill you. That will be the solution. Kelvin, kill me and end everything. Just kill me. Because I am not going anywhere. You must marry me whether you like it or not. You think you can just choose me and throw me out like some piece of shit? Rubbish. You can force a house to the river, but cannot force it to drink. You can fight within your powers, but what will be, will be. You cannot break a bond that is so strong. A bond built in true love. A bond built in true love. Please get up, we need to talk. Kelvin, mm. we need to talk. See, I don't want to. I just want to relax. Why are you disturbing my peace? Please just hear me out. Kelvin. You're disturbing me. What is this now? Kelvin, I am sorry. Okay? I'm sorry for everything. I did all those things because I love you. And I can't afford to share you with another woman. Kelvin. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. I beg you in the name of God. Please just forgive me. You're just wasting your time begging, okay? <laughs> Kelvin. You know, you know how my fat is. It might blind you, it might make you faint. It will make me to fat on your face. I'm sorry now. Please just hear me out. I'm sorry. Just forgive me, please. Stop trying. Stop trying. Kelvin. You better stop this it. She is shaking me up. Hmm. Kelvin. 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 Stop talking me now. I'm not a girl. Don't say me now. I'm sorry. You did not go to work today. What happened? My dear, wish work. I resigned though. Why? Ha. I thought you said the man is treating you well. It's not the man that is my problem. It's that useless girl that he wants to marry. She accused me of having an affair with my boss. So? Ha. My dear. My life is so important to me. I don't want to die, you. She threatened to kill me. And you know that I'm the only child of my parents. I can't lose my life now. <laughs> what did the man say? The man? Ha. The man doesn't have any problem. He said I should not quit. But I don't have any. I can't even wait because I don't know what this girl has in mind to do. Are you really having an affair with him? You know you're my friend. You can really confine him. <sighs> Helene, are you the one asking me this? Oh, you should know me by now. I can't have an affair with my boss. Just calm down. Who are you, this idiot? I gotta punish you today. So you think I will allow you go scot you after ruining my relationship, right? Madam, I didn't do you anything. I'm not having an affair with your husband. You are very stupid. You are an idiot. Oh, you think you can cost me my relationship and then go? Do you know her? Is she your friend or your sister? She's my friend. This imbecile, yeah. She has cost me my relationship. My wedding was fixed for next month, but guess what? It's no longer happening because she wouldn't allow my husband be. Madam, she wouldn't allow my husband be. I would just allow you go. 
I'll just I'll just allow you go smart like that. I'm not going to be with you. Leave me my relationship. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. If I'm in your relationship, leave my friend alone, madam, please. Wait, 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 please turn, turn, turn around, turn around. Let's go back to the house. Give me back to where you put people, please. I will pay, I will pay, I will pay. Please, hurry. Hurry, hurry. Is this not the book I've been asking Rita to read you? To read? I am going to read it today. It is good. Must be an interesting. Hello. Give my money. Don't delay me. Give my money. Please, look, I'm coming. Don't you be filming. Let me bring something. I'm coming. I forgot something. Oh my god. Um, Rita, you forgot the book. Uh, yes, yes, yes. I did. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, yes. Can I take a look at the picture? Oh, I'm in a hurry. Later, later. Later. Why is she hiding the picture? What are you going to do now? I'm waiting for my mother to come. So you have to wait for your mother to come before you can take a position? No, not that. I just want to satisfy my mother's wish. I can take my decision for myself. I mean... You know why I'm saying this? Why? I have come to take what is mine. Zara should go where she belongs. You see, I'm just doing this because of my mother. Okay? I don't want her to start blaming me for anything. Zara has crossed her boundaries and she must face the consequences. So 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 what if what if she says otherwise? How? If she insists you must marry Zara. The decision is mine, and that's final. I've made my own decision. Okay? Does Kate know that we are close to each other? Not yet. I don't want her to know now. You remember this? Wow. You still keep this? I remember the day I had the flowers on you. You look gorgeous. <laughs> I'm so happy I found you again. Thank you. This picture. <laughs> <laughs> Let me have it back. Wow. Um, I'm hungry. Do you mind if we go to somewhere and eat? What response are you expecting? No, of course not. Yes. <laughs> slap is not enough. What is slap? should have killed her. Mommy, don't you trust your daughter? 
Don't you know what I can do? Mom, you needed to see what I did to that girl. Mom. If not for the fact that her friend was dead, I would have killed her and buried her. That is it. <laughs> don't you I, trust me? I am solidly behind you. Yes, like a rock. So don't be scared. Even his mother is solidly behind me. She says she's coming today. Which means you are 100% sure. Safe. Safe, very safe. Hey, you see that boy? I will never allow you step out of that house. You will not take an inch out of that house. After using me once, you don't feel like a piece of life. It will not work. That's what I told you. He cannot throw me out. It's not even possible. After three years of, of relationship. Yes. Where? When I'm still alive, it will never work. Tell me the reason why you're afraid. But mom, what if that secretary is using a charm on me? You know, girls of these days, what, what they cannot do does not exist. You can't trust them. Zara, you just got me angry right now. They are talking of sham. Sham. Hey, hey. You are talking about sham where I am. When it comes to the worst, I will take the native doctor's shrine and the native doctor straight into my house. Yes, when I give him money, he brings it. I give him money, he brings it. I don't know my money. Of course, I am your mother. Hey! Kevin should come and throw me out of his house to let me see. He cannot do that. He cannot. He can never try it. I will not allow him to do it. To use you like a piece of rag and dump you, it will never happen. I am proud to be your daughter. Very, very proud also to be your mother because my duty is to protect you and give you a good life. Yes. That's how you should be. And don't talk about sham again, bam, bam, bam. Don't, don't go that way. Because when you call that sham, my head turns. Because I will collect the shrine and the native doctor and bring them here. So they don't have to go anywhere wow. before I begin to operate. Mm -hmm. And all of your delegates will just toss me, toss me out like a, like a piece of trash. It will not work. It will not work. Never. Hmm? I'm hungry. Did you cook? Oh, has to. Hi. Five wraps. Hi. I mounted them. One after the other. Ah, ah. Hello, hello. Yes. Oh, I love you. Thank you. Hey. Oh, thank you. 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 Thank Oh, she's very fine. I went to visit her today and she actually asked about you. Oh, yeah. I'll get to see her someday. I am sure she'll be happy to see you too. Mm. I'll be in the kitchen. Okay, my dear. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. She's such a good girl. I don't know what has gotten over my son. No. He has to stop saying that girl. That demon of a girl. No, not in this house. That is my wife. You can fight within oh. your powers, but what will be will be. You cannot break. Thank you so much. You've actually made my day. I should be the one thanking you for accepting to do this for us. You're welcome. You're still the same which I used to know back in the days. Not really changed. Even though we lost contact, you know, but you're still the same person I used to know back in the days. And you are still the same Kelvin of yesterday. I'm so happy to have found you again. Likewise, here. You should get going then. It's late already. Okay then. See you. Good night. So strong, a bond beauty in true love, a bond beauty in true love. Cause no matter what, no matter the fight, and the obstacles, what we be will be, 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 no matter the challenges and obstructions. What has she been since afternoon? 
Her number has been switched off. Look at the time. And she's not yet back. Rita is seeing someone, but she doesn't want me to know about it. I'm sure that picture she was hiding has a connection to this. What happened to your phone? What okay. happened to your phone? Sorry. My battery ran off. I knew you'd be worried. Who are you seeing? <sighs> He's my friend. And you don't want to tell me about it? Look, I was going to tell you. But the thing is, I'm still taking my time to you know, get to know him before I discuss him with you. Rita, you're in my house. I need to know wherever you go to each time you leave the house. In case of anything, not for any other reason. Just for your safety. I understand. No vex. Don't worry. I'll tell you about him soon. Okay. Let me go in and freshen up. I'll join you soon. I said it. I need to find out who the person is before I get myself into what I don't know about. So, what is he doing outside till this time of the night? Mm. It should have been seeing me. And to think of it, he's not even picking my cups. Mm, don't worry yourself, he will soon be back. I'm already getting used to it. Mm? It's not true. You won't get used to this. Ah, let him come back and tell me where he has been till this time of the night. Oh. Hi, Mom. Good yeah. evening. Where are you coming back from? At this time of the night? Mom, I went to visit a friend. Hmm? Yeah. Is there anything the matter? So, you come back at this time of the night? And you asking me, is anything the matter? <laughs> Mom, <laughs> what are you saying? What I'm saying, Kelvin, is that you should stop visiting that girl. That's what I'm saying. Is that what she told you? Hmm. Nobody told me anything, Kelvin. I am judging you by what I see. Look at the time you're returning home. Is that the way I raised you? Mm. Mom. Um, as you can see, I'm so tired and I don't, I don't have strength to talk much. Seriously? I need, I need to rest. I'm making noise, right? I never said so, Mom. Kelvin, nobody sleeps this night until I finish the meeting I want to have with both of you. No meeting for me, oh. Yes, because I'm going to rest. Oh, Kelvin! No meeting, no. I need to rest, please. Kelvin! Mom, I need to rest. You are walking out on me, Kelvin! Kelvin, I will come to that bedroom and I will pour hot water on you. What rubbish! Mommy, you have seen it now. No, 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 no. I didn't bring him up this way. It will stop. You say you're going to get used to what? To my son returning home at night? What can I do? Yeah. You can force the house to the river, but cannot force it to drink. You can fight. Within your powers, but what will be will be. You cannot break a bond that is so strong. A bond built in true love. A bond built in true love. It is not Kevin's number. How did he get Rita's number? And why is he calling her? Oh, and I was looking for my phone card. Mm. 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 
Excuse me. What is going on here? I, I, I don't understand what is happening. Why is Kevin calling Rita? I don't understand. My night was fine and yours? Where are you? Really? Okay. So, did the mother still come? And what did she say? Baby, I am sick and tired of this hide and seek game. When is it going to end? It is high time you held the bull by the horn and let your mother know the truth. Taking your breakfast. No, I'm late already. Uh -oh. What is it? Mom, Kevin has refused to take his breakfast. I don't know what I've done to him. He's hell bent on ruining my life. Okay. Nobody should blame me if I do anything crazy tomorrow. What is that? Have I not assured you that I'll settle this matter? Look, huh? Mom, Kevin has gone far with his outside affairs. Something happened this morning. What happened? Huh? Mom, I don't want to tell you about it now because... Because what? Because what? Don't you have confidence in me anymore? Talk to me! I do have confidence in you. Ah. Talk to me. I have told you I will settle this matter. I will fix it. Tell me what happened. Ah. Yeah. Okay. You can pass us to the river, but cannot pass it to Madam, I am not here for jokes. Go in there and call your husband. Hey, stop shouting at me, Vikram. I'm not your wife. I said my husband is not at home. And you think I'm blind? Come I on. saw him as I was coming in, rolling inside. Go oh. in there and call him. He must give me my money today. Okay, so what do If he comes back, I will tell him what he Comes back from here. From I said, go in there and call. Come. 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 Hey! You give my house for me. I am ready for anything. Just give me my money. Peter, do you know you are a wicked man? I paid you for charter to take me to my laws. And you 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 took my money and off your phone. And you are here talking rubbish. I need my money. I didn't offer to it. It's important. I don't want to know. I need my money. I will pay you. See, see. Anything he wants to do, I will give it to him. Yes. You will give me. If you give me, I will not marry you. You are killing me. Who wants to marry you? All I want is my money. My money. You will get him. My money. Peter. Peter. Hero. Oh, are you going now? 
out. Yes. Okay. Yes. I'm coming out. I have something to tell you. All right. Could it be that they've known each other? Kelvin and Rita. Has it gone? Amaka, has Victor gone? Peter. Um, you mean to tell me that you faked it before you go? Hey, so, <laughs> so you don't know the husband that you married? Hey, look, the way the man was holding my neck, holding my neck. I know that if I don't fake it, eh, the man was going to enjoy me. <laughs> eh? And now, eh, <laughs> if he comes here again for his money, he will pay damages. Hey, you know you have sense. I don't know you have this kind of sense. What kind of insult is that? Ah. You mean I don't have sense before? Uh, Are you sense around me? What's wrong with you? <laughs> See, eh? You made my mind to skip home. I thought that you are dead. I said, if I pour this water on you now and you do not wake up, I will go straight to the police and report to them so that they will go and arrest Victor. Uh, that one is not necessary. <laughs> eh? Victor, Victor does not know the kind of person I have. He was joking with me. Now, eh? That is 20,000 naira is gone. But I'm, eh? I'm, I'm going to obtain more from him. Uh -uh. Yes. Uh, see, eh? Had it been that you've been applying this kind of sense ever since you were married, eh? By now, you would have become a millionaire. Yeah. <laughs> stop insulting me. Huh? Yeah, stop insulting me. How am I insulting you? If you look, if you want to cause a small child, you praise the father. Yeah, that is what you are trying to do. Hi! <laughs> <laughs> what am I going to get for me? Can I get you what I go? What happened? Then the other man asked me. He nearly killed my husband. Now you're asking me to come back and ask me what happened. Oh, what do you want me to tell? Where's he now? Hey! I rushed him to the hospital. Now, doctor is demanding for 50,000 naira. Now, doctor is demanding 50,000 naira. Where am I going to get that money from? He, he said I must bring 50,000 before he will commence treatment. What? Hi! Wait, where's the, where's the hospital? Huh? The hospital. Oh, you want me to tell you where the hospital is so that you go there and finish him up and kill him? Chukwa, I will not even marry you. You want to kill my husband? Anyway, anyway, calm down. Hi! Ah! We will calm down. Yeah. See, here is 30,000. Give it to the doctor. Beg him to collect this money and start the treatment first. Huh? How much? This is 30,000. Victor, have you seen it? Have you seen it? I, I said it that you're a wicked man. You are very heartless. I told you now that the doctor said we should bring 50,000 and you're giving me 30,000, which means you want my husband to die. <laughs> you think if he died that I will come and marry you? I will not marry you. Oh. I will not marry you. See, this is all I have now. This is 15,000. Making it forty-five. Forty-five thousand. Mm. And you, you, you will bring the remaining five thousand. That is not the problem. Five thousand is not. The problem. Five thousand yeah, is not. Please, go and give it to the doctor uh, to comment to you. Just, just pray that if I give you this one, that my husband will survive, bro, because he's in a critical condition. Not, not, not to happen to him. Yeah? Yes, please start to go. Oh, I, hate, I, don't, I hate to see you around me. <laughs> you nearly killed my husband. Start going. Hey! Make your even if I pay this money, please. Help my husband, do Let him not die, yo. Hey! Hey! Let nothing happen to my husband, do Let nothing happen to my husband, do Hey! How can you claim what does not belong to you? Happiness <laughs> first, then destruction follows. Come out your eye, you're forgetting no be your own. Evil people everywhere. Wicked people everywhere. Patrolling like hungry wolves.
Zara, I've told you to stop brooding over this matter. Mommy, I'm afraid I'm going to lose Kelvin. That will not happen. Just calm down. It's not happening. Calm down. Mommy, ah. I, I swear, if I see that girl again, I will kill her. Mm -mm. No, no, no. You're not killing anybody. Ah, what is killing? We're not killing anybody. I can't even believe this is happening to me. Mm. What have I done to Kelvin? All I've done is to be a good girlfriend. I don't have any other man in my life except Kelvin. And you used to boast so much about that. You told me how much he trusted you. Then why is he doing this? Eh? Mommy, do you know Kelvin told me to my face that it is over between us? He almost threw my things outside, if not for your intervention. What have I done to him? Don't worry. I've told you not to be afraid. Okay? I know how to handle Kelvin. Just leave it to me, okay? Okay. When it's time, just let me know, okay? Okay, mom. Relax. Ah, you worry too much. Okay, How am I feeling like this? I feel so uneasy. So restless. What's wrong with me? Now we can go, but when we get there, allow me to do the talking, okay? Okay, ma'am. Let's go. Okay. Mm. 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 Life is good. All the time. Mm. <laughs> well, see, eh? after we finish this now, we we'll go inside and complete it with the furniture. <laughs> <That are good. laughs> <laughs> my husband, you're making my body to receive me. <laughs> <laughs> Let us go see. You. <laughs> you see, eh? mm. it's good to have sense, though. Eh? All of a sudden, too much sense. The hunter became the hunted. hunted. Eh? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Somebody that I was owing now paid me more than twice the amount that I was owing. Hey. You see that guy? Too? Sense good though. Sense will not kill us. Look, this our combination is very good though. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You know, computer, you have hardware and software. Mm -hmm. I am the hardware. You are the software. Mm -hmm. So once I on like this, baby, you program, mm -hmm. you do the programming, mm -hmm. you run it, and you deliver. I'm the master planner, and you are the chief executioner. No, you okay, mm -hmm. okay. That is true. Mm -hmm. Because you are the one who is running the program. Mm -hmm. Then I execute. Mm -hmm. You. Eh? <laughs> I'm too much. <laughs> What of the chicken pepper soup? The it's chicken on fire. is still on fire. Good. See, eh? mm. after we finish this pe uh, fish pepper soup, mm. we will use the chicken pepper soup to download it, mm -hmm. digest it, mm -hmm. upload it, mm -hmm. and uplift it. And, and consolidate it. And consolidate <laughs> it. Hey! Give it to me, give it to me. Oh! You are making my body to be sweet, me. You know, you have a very good husband. Mm -hmm. Very understanding. <laughs> hey. So, you know, that man is still owing us 5,000 um, um, naira. Hmm? The remaining 5,000 naira is for me alone. Eh? Mm. What did you just say? Oh, what do you want? That 5,000 that is remaining, mm. I will use it to bob my hair and uh, carve it. You know, the two lines you always like me to do. I'll carve it smooth, yeah? Then, paint my nails, do pedicure and manicure. This is so that I, I will problem. shine for you. I'll be shining and glowing. This is where I have a problem with you. Huh? Modern day girls are talking of both straights. Human hair. You are talking of Babylon. This one is low already. You are looking like an old woman with this one. Is this it one, of you? Huh? 
Eh? But you told me to always cut my hair. Who told you that? I'm trying to save money for save you. Money we are talking for about most threats. Most threat is uh, 300,000, 500,000. We no. don't give it to me. Go to. and bring the balance of that money because he gave us 45,000 naira. Mm -hmm. Now, if you calculate the cost of uh, preparing this uh, fish pepper soup, the chicken pepper soup, and maybe some, okay, some of these drinks, it's up to maybe five, 7,000. Go and bring the balance. Oh. I kept it well. I know where I kept it. Hmm? Okay, I kept it well. I'm going to keep this one well. Yes, and in fact, ah. that chicken pepper soup on fire belongs to me, except to give me my money. I am the owner of that money. Why are you the one that fainted? Eh? Why didn't you faint with me when I was fainting? When you fainted, were you the one that brought that, that, that got that 45,000 from him? I eh? understand. If I did not tell him that I, you, you, you were in the hospital, would he have given me that money? Was I not the one who gave you the key? Well, did did that tell you that you're going to pay more? If I didn't execute this and plan it, would he have bring that money? Why are you the software? I am handling you are the software. Ah. All I need to do is to give you the key. Then Peter. you program it. Now tell me, look. Give me this fish. Give me my because money. You, okay, I will not bring the money. Then you will not eat from this fish. Let us see the money and the fish, the one that is given. I will hold the money. I will hold the fish, uh, chicken pepper soup. Mbano. I'm not bring the money. Oh. Which money? I'm not bring that money. That, that money is mine. Bring that money. Oh. Mm. I'm not mm. bring the money. Oh. Money. Mm. Okay. At the time, I thought you're not coming again. Well, I'm sorry. I didn't hear my words that I'll come. It's so wonderful and so nice to behold your beautiful face again. Thank you. Can I ask you for a favor? Sure. I get to be coming. I don't even know what you want to ask. Don't you trust me again? Of course, I do. So should I ask, are you going to do it for me? Ask. And it shall be given unto you. Okay. Do you remember the picture you came with to my office the other time? Mm-hmm. Why do you ask? I want it. <laughs> Why? And is that a favor you wanted to ask? Mm-hmm. Okay. I'll give you. With all pleasure. Then, it then doesn't matter. It doesn't matter either of us who is in possession of it. Let me have it then. What? I can't find the picture. Is that a kind of ploy not to grant my request? No. I left the house with it. And suddenly you're looking for it. I had it in my bag. Did you take it? No, I did not. Did you see me touch your bag? Maybe you unconsciously left it at home. No, I'm sure about that. I will not leave here. Amaka, send me my trousers. Peter, give me that money. Give it to me. Uh -uh, nothing on earth will make me. Leave you until you give me that money. For the last time, I'm not leave me. <laughs> Look, <laughs> I will give you a back auto. Yeah, I will give you a back auto. Okay, if you don't want that one, I will give you Kung Fu. Here, snake in the monkey shadow. You here. Yeah. I'm okay. okay, do you want me to give you a bow? I'll give you a bow. Leave my trouser. I'll give you a bow. Hey, uh, is it any you? Oh, the okay. You know the doctor said I should come back. Peter, will you doctor. stop that? Which doctor? Your wife told me you were rushed to hospital. Uh, you, was that a lie? Eh? Oh, you, oh, you are not happy that the doctor treated me in record time and saved my life. Peter, oh, so you okay? Go and jubilate. If I had died, you come. No, eh? no. Are you saying you just regain yourself immediately, Victor? It was out of pity that the doctor discharged my husband. Uh -huh. Hope you came with the 5,000 naira, the remaining 5,000. Mm. What 5,000 are you talking about? 
The doctor said we should bring it. Victor, are you saying that you didn't come with these 5,000 naira to give to my wife to go and give to the doctor? The doctor said we should bring it this evening so that he can give me for that treatment. For my neck, in fact. Hey! hey. Both of you are talking nonsense. Oh no, I'll say 5,000. <laughs> Wait, oh, Amaka. He still have your mouth to talk. Is it because when I was there, my wife told me that they wanted to arrest you and put in police cell? And I said, no, I know the man very well. Don't arrest him. That is why you are talking like this. Where is my phone? I will have to call the police. Do you even know the degree of your offense? Now let me count it for you. Attempted murder. One. Conspiracy to commit murder. Two. Second degree murder in attempting. Three. Then the combination of both attempting and murdering at the same time. Come, Victor, be take, take time off. <laughs> Go and bring my phone. You are in for bigger sound. Now listen, now listen. Both of you have failed. Eh? Yes. Uno a fail, Hugo. Wait. Oh, you think you can duke me and go score free? I'm back. Like I said before, both of you have failed. Okay. Hey! Allow me. Uh, and you will hear from me. Okay, Victor. Oh, look here. This your, you see this your deck? Victor. You've not said anything. You will hear from me. You are not happy oh, that my I husband is alive. Anything. You will hear from me. You are not happy that my husband is alive. Or husband. Look at this man. Or husband. Don't worry. As you are going home with the 5,000 naira you are going to bring. Oh, <laughs> Victor. Zukwani Ike. Zukwani Ike. Eh? You know where it's going. You are seeing me. Hey, because this one is going now. We don't know his plan. No. Are we safe? <laughs> How did you? He want me to answer you. Hmm? Don't ask, uh, uh, ask me stupid Are you not the programmer? Are you not the, 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 the reason for this? Eh? Oh, oh, oh. See, the way this man left this house, in the next 10 minutes, he will be back with the police. And by that time, <laughs> if you go from, I will, you will not see me in this. If I don't see you, who will do the programming? He. Uh, wait for me, I will go with you. Lock the door. Hey, Amaka, I left my phone on top of the bed. Oh, hurry up now. Go and bring it. Ah. Peter, hurry up. Hurry up. We don't have time. I'm coming. I'm not looking for my wife. Hey! What kind of a man is this? Eh? Get me the one for the fat. Look at here now, brother. Uh -huh. I am here to see you. To see me? Mm. Sorry. As you can see, we are in a hurry. Eh? You out. can come back next time. Please, let's go. Let's go. Yeah. I'm not going anywhere. You're not going nowhere. Eh? You're not going nowhere. Give me the keys to my brother's house in the city. Eh? I say you should give me the keys to my brother's house in the city. The house key. Uh -huh. Give it to me. Did our brother meet you in your dream and told you that he handed over the keys to me before he died? Huh? Hey, Peter, don't worry. Eh? Eh, you people can sort out your problems. And when you're done, you will meet me. Mm -hmm. And you call yourself my wife. Eh? You are abandoning me. You can give me the khaki. I'm going. So later you need to. Are, are you going to leave me? I said give me the khaki. Stop it. Did you come with this police? Madam, move up. You are criminals. This woman. Criminals. And the husband. Who is a criminal? Uh, that's a man. You have to remain silent. For whatever you do or say, will be used against you in the court of law. Hey, you man, where are you going to? Come back here. Officer, look after her. You see yourself? You're abandoning your husband. I just stop what, what is it, sir? Every time you have to remain silent. You have to remain silent. And you come to arrest. You go, okay, okay, how will I judge my case if I remain silent? What is it? What did I do now? Oh. Hey, Peter, ah. Peter, shut up. Let me talk to this gentleman. My brother, gentleman, please. Uh, I want to beg you before you arrest. Allow him to give me the keys to my brother's house in the city. Eh? Madam, that does not concern. 
Yes. You can sort yourself out with them when I'm through with him. Officers, to the car. Move them. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, move. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Mr. Man, don't, don't you move. Push, no. oh, no, you hey. move. You move. You move. Hey. You move. You are, you are, you are an Amaka. Hey! I've never seen people like you. Criminals. Oh, hey! That girl had the guts to attack me in my man's office. I will never allow her to take my man from me. Not even Kelvin's mother will stop me. Nobody. Ah. Are you alright? What mm. happened? I'm okay. What happened to your hair? It's breeze inside your hair. Are you serious? Yeah. Are you sure? Anyway, you forgot this inside the room, so I have to. Thank you. You mean to say you know Kelvin before you came here? Yes. We were lovers, but we lost contact. And we would have started seeing each other again without you telling me. Kate! Oh! So it was your plan, right? So you brought this stupid friend of yours to my house in order for her to snatch my mom from me, right? I don't understand what you're talking about here. You don't understand what she's talking about. You don't know. What did I tell you the day I sent you out of my son's office? Eh? What did I tell you? So your mission is to, to, to tell your friend to my son, eh? No, 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 please, ma'am. Please. Kate knows nothing about this. Mm. I was just trying to explain to her about Kevin and I before you both walked in. Mm-hmm. I have known your son years before now. Yeah. As a matter of fact, he's the one who deflowered me. Mm. And truth is, there is no way I am letting anybody take him from me. Never! My you say that to me? You're saying that to me? You're boasting? Nobody can take my son from you? You are a thief. You are a bloody thief. Let me tell you. My son is engaged to Zara here. And the date for their wedding has been fixed. Did you get that? Let me warn you. Stay away from my son if you really value your life. Last warning. You told you respect me. Better. I will lay down my life for the one I love. Oh! I am not giving Kevin to anybody. Not even you. He is mine and mine alone. Then you will have to die. <laughs> yes. You will have to die because I will not allow you rip from where you did not sow. I contributed to Kelvin's success. So therefore, I would never allow another woman to rip the fruit of my labor. Get that into your head. You're a joker. Kelvin is my life. And I his. We are inseparable. Ask him. He'll tell you it's over between you both. The next time you try this, I'll make you regret your life. Hey, Zara, save it. Save it! Save it. You'll hear from me. Let it not be that they've gone to attack Rita in Kate's house. I won't allow this to happen. I have to rush there immediately. Kevin! Kevin! deceive you. You deceived yourself, my friend. You deceived yourself. You killed the love I have for you the moment you start suspecting me, accusing me of sleeping 
with my secretary. How dare you? Gary, are you crazy or something? Gary, now what? listen to me. I want you to stop saying that, girl. Unless you want me to kill myself on you. Mom, you are making a mistake. I am not. I'm not making any mistake. Let me tell you, the only girl you are allowed to marry is Zara here. I don't want you to bring or make the move of, of marrying any other girl. If you dare make the move of marrying any other girl, Kevin, I will kill myself. I don't care whose virginity you have taken in the past. Try me. I will kill myself. And that is final. Let's go! Kevin, I am so disappointed in you. Never in my wildest dream will I believe that you could do this to me. I will make Rita pay for this. Bet it. I want to apologize to you for not telling you about Kelvin and I. I had it in mind to tell you, but I didn't know how to, considering that Zara is your friend. But honestly, Kelvin and I love each other. So that was then, Rita. Rita, that was then. Kevin is now engaged to be married to, to, to Zara. Why do you allow the past to mislead me? Kate, you would do the same thing if you were in my shoes. It's a lie. I will not be so foolish to destroy a wedding that has been fixed already. Hey, Rita, do you know what you've cost me? Zara was the one that secured a job for me in her place of work. Now you've destroyed the relationship. You don't have to blame me. I will blame you a hundred times, Rita. What you did was totally wrong. Both in the eyes of men and in the eyes of God. Kate, are you not going to say anything about my virginity which I lost to him? Are you the only one that was deflowered? Listen, the man responsible for mine is no longer in my life. Do I need to kill myself because of that? Answer me! In other words, leave Kelvin alone. Zara is his fiancé. Allow them to get married in peace. Just pray to God for him to give you another man. Okay? Okay. Thanks for the advice. I needed to tell her the truth. Huh? So this girl has been in my house and she was hiding to go and see Kelvin without letting me know. She's a betrayer. This girl is so wicked! Ah! Zara, you have to be up and doing from now. Do you understand me? You have to be up and doing. One whose house is on fire does not go about chasing rats. Mommy, what have I not done? You have tried your best. Yes, I, I believe. But there's one thing left. There's one thing left. I, I, I don't understand. You have to get pregnant for my son. Yes. You have to get pregnant for him. That is the only weapon for victory in this battle. No, ma'am, how is that going to be possible? Kevin does not allow me into his room. How am I going to do that? See, just leave that to me. I will make sure you start sleeping in that room. From now, Zara, you are a woman. Use the power of a woman. Eh? Oh, I'm not sure this is going to be possible. You know, Calvin. Oh, See, I don't like this. 
Stop being negative. Stop being negative. Something is very wrong somewhere. My son has never been stubborn to me. That useless girl must have given him something. <laughs> Obviously, Zara alone cannot do this. I have to do something. You cannot break a bond that is so strong. A bond built in true love. A bond built in true love. Cause no matter what, no matter the fight, and the obstacles. What we be will be. 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 No matter the challenges and obstructions. No matter the delay. What we be will be. 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 So why plan evil for a harmless fella? Knowing too well is not the right way to follow. Hey, what goes around must come around to yeah. trade with caution. You can force us to the river, but cannot force it to drink. Oh my God! Hey, 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 this is you. This is you. Hey, mama. Yeah, welcome. Yeah, yeah, welcome. Mama. Hey, mama, how are you doing? I'm fine, very fine. I'm very fine. How are you? I'm good, Mama. When I'm did you good. Come? I came back four days ago. Four days ago? Yes, Mama. And you didn't even bother to call me? No, Mama. I've been trying to reach you, but the network was bad. Yes. yes. Network was bad. One, two, three, four days. And you're sleeping comfortably. No, Again, mama. I said I've been trying to reach you, Mama. This is network. Ah, yes. So why is business? Business is fine. Thank God. This yes, is you like one of your kind. Yeah, mama. This is what I'm wanting. Yeah. What did you say? Manage. Manage. <laughs> Manage. 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 Hey, what? What are you saying? Take it. Mm. 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 You are welcome. Yes. You are welcome, my son. Ekene? Mama. You are looking handsome every day. Oh, thank you, Mama. Thank you. Look at you. Too. Don't, don't, don't. <laughs> Let me look at you very well. Hello, my uh, son. God is God has been faithful. I know. Yes. Let's go inside. Okay, Mama. Yeah, 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 uh, what, what do you have? I have food. Don't worry. I was just trying to prepare. You're you trying to prepare all you have prepared. Don't worry. I have no food. I have your favorite. Hey, 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 hey. hey. So let's go. Hey. Uh, yes, I, I, I forgot. <laughs> I forgot to ask you. Bring it. <laughs> Why are you just set the table? Huh? Mommy, Sky is not there. You mean you don't know when he left? No, I was in your room. He was gone by the time I came out. It doesn't matter. Don't bother yourself, okay? Just keep sleeping in that room. One day something will happen. Okay? okay. Mom, are you still going back to bed? Yes. But I'll wait for him to come back. I miss you. I wish you can just stay with us and not go back. Mm. At least Kevin will not be doing all this thing he's doing. <laughs> it's okay. I'll be coming from time to time. Hmm? Uh, let me go take my bath and get ready. Okay? okay. <sighs> Thank God for this woman. She made the bath so easy for me. At least I get to sleep in the same room with Kelvin. Mom? Hello, Mom. Are you serious? Ekene is back. Okay, I'm coming. Yes, I'm coming! Some good news. <laughs> Hi, Kate. Hi, good afternoon. How are you? I'm fine. Okay, uh, Kate, I'm just coming from the house and I couldn't find Rita. I've been trying her number and she has not been going for two days now. Well, um, I don't know her whereabouts for now. 
What do you mean by that? Uh, she left my house two days ago. Uh, are you trying to say that you don't know where Rita is? I, I don't know. Uh, please, can you help me at least locate her? I need to see her. I am sorry. Like I said, I, I don't know her whereabouts for now. Excuse me. How can Rita just disappear into thin air just like that? And Kate is saying that she doesn't know her whereabouts. What's going on? So you wanted me to tell him Rita's whereabouts. Thank God for the answer he gave him. I wouldn't have told him the children of us, please. Nothing. What are you trying to do? I'm leaving. Let me just go back to my father's house. I don't understand. Did I ask you to leave? No, you did not. I just want to go back. And thank you so much for your hospitality. I really appreciate it. You're serious about this? Yes. And don't be angry. Don't worry. I'll visit you from time to time. Thank you. I am happy they are both separated now. Marita switched off her phone since then she left you. What we be will be. What we be will be. What we be will be. No matter the challenges and obstructions. No matter the delay. What we be will be. 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 So why plan me before? So who exactly is that lady? Who is that lady? She's a friend to my friend Kate. Don't get me confused. Explain it to me. It is right. Who is she? Okay. You know Kate's my friend. Yes. She's Kate's friend. Okay. My name is Rita. But honestly speaking now, I was very happy that Kelvin's mother was there to witness the whole thing. If not, it would have looked like I fabricated the whole story. Uh, but why is this guy behaving like that? Sleeping with women here and there? Mm -hmm. Why don't you think you should let him go? Eh? What did you say? Let him go. Yeah, 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 yeah. If you know you're tired, just go inside and sleep. Go and rest. And stop speaking English. Did you know how many years my daughter has put into this relationship? It doesn't. Oh, you think I will allow that boy use my daughter? Like a piece of rag and just dump her, mommy. Uh, okay, mama. What if Zara gets married to this to this guy? I end up sleeping with all the women in the world. Don't bother yourself. No one will get to that bridge. We will cross it. When he finally gets married to my daughter, I will teach him what to do. Just leave that one alone. Mama, prevention is better than cure. Okay, man. You don't know this story. You don't know how it started. Look, I would rather kill <laughs> than have another woman take what belongs to me. Eh? It is that deep. Well, let's not be as if I'm interfering. 
But you people have to be very, very careful. Biko, Biko, before I forget, where is my own parcel from South Africa? Uh, don't worry, mom will take care of that. I don't understand. Why is mom taking care of it? Huh? She will get, she will get. Everything is in her control. Don't worry. Come on, calm down. Calm down. <laughs> so your mother in law has gone back. Okay, she has gone back. It's just me and the son now. Okay, no problem. You cannot break. A bond that is so strong. A bond built in true love. A bond built in true. Mom, as I'm talking to you now, Kelvin is not at home. I don't know. I have been calling him, but he's not taking any of my calls. Look, Mom, I am very worried about him. Where will he be by this time of the night? It's 2.45 a.m. Oh, okay, Mom. Mom, please try and call him. Maybe he will take your own call. Okay, I'll call you back later. Okay. You can fight within your powers. But what will be, will be. You cannot break. A bond that is so strong. I'm sorry, he's not going to say something. She's still talking. Did you ask about the former secretary and how she ended her job here? Maybe you should do it. The next time you try and stop me here, she won't like it. Last time my husband came to work, two days ago, ma. Two days ago? Yeah. Do you have any idea why he has not been to the office for the past two days? No, ma. So you're saying you don't call him with him? No, he called two days ago, saying that we are really for some time. But I see that I'm going to So you're telling me that you don't use your account? So what if I find out you're lying to me? No, 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 no. Manage this one. Yeah? No, I don't have the outfit on the um, Manage this one. Okay. Yeah? Manage this one. I don't have the yeah? same. Manage, thank you.
But I thought Peter said Rita ran away with the key of this house. It looks like somebody is in this house. What is happening here? Okay, let me, let me. Mean of what? I will not believe what no. I had to hear. Hmm. Hey. What did you hear? Your sister has just traveled to the city. And you know where her destination is? Your late brother's house. <laughs> How did you know that? I went to Mama Chinedi's shop to buy something. And she told me that your sister just left her shop. And she told her that she's traveling to the city. <laughs> that cannot be true. Huh. Ah, no, no. It's not possible. So you want to start arguing with me again? Oh yeah? Uh, see, I know my sister will. If what you are saying is true, eh? Uh, that woman will get to the city, break the gate open, enter the house and confiscate everything in that house. Okay. Everything that belongs to my brother. Thank and, God. And that will not be good for us. Thank God. For once, for the first time, you are raising like a normal woman. Come inside, let me tell you what you are going to do. Come, 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 come. What is the meaning of that? Huh? Eh? No, no, no. Why are you insulting me? How can you say I'm reasoning like a human being for the first time? Does it mean I'll be reasoning like an animal? What's wrong with you? <laughs> are you smarter than me, George? You are trying to claim as if you are the master now. Just shut up! <laughs> when you don't have anything here. Go inside. Let me tell no. you what you are going to do. If you have anything to tell me, come and tell me, but don't insult me. Who are you? <laughs> you village twat. I am the game master. Game what? <laughs> the master planner. So come out your eye of for waiting no be your owner. Evil people everywhere. Hey, wicked people everywhere. They're trolling like hungry wolves. Attacking the innocent. Oh, I, evil people everywhere. Wicked people everywhere. Auntie! <laughs> Rita! I've been knocking for ages. So sorry, I was in the kitchen cooking. Come in, come in, come in. Oh. Are you done with the cooking now? Uh, no, no, no. But very soon. I'm very hungry. It's okay. Come in and freshen up. Mm. How was your journey? Fine. <laughs> mm -hmm. Mom. Mommy, I am not fine. Today is the fourth day Kelvin left the house and he has refused to pick my coat. He has been absent from the office too. 
Yes, I, I, I went to the office and the secretary said she knows she, she doesn't know his whereabouts. Ma? You want me to go back to the office? Okay. Mommy, please call him. I am worried about him, please. Okay, ma. Okay, go get it and call me. I said I should not call him. You should be the one calling me. Are you mad? You're trying to be mad. I said go get your phone and call my husband. the challenges and obstructions no matter the delay what we be will be what we be will be what we be will be so why plan evil for a harmless fellow Kate what are you doing in my house um look Kate I, I am sorry I know I am not supposed to be here but please can you give me a little audience? If you're here to ask about Brita, you're wasting your time. Because I don't know... I am not here for Brita, but for Kelvin. Kelvin left the house four days ago, and he has not been taking or returning my calls. And he has not been to the office either. Oh, Kelvin? And you think he's in my house? Hmm? For your information, young woman. Rita left here five days ago. And for your Kelvin, he was here to ask about Rita's whereabouts. And I told him that I don't know about Rita. Mm. So Kelvin was here to ask about her. Uh, oh, okay. Thank you. And Kate, I am really sorry for the way I spoke to you the last time I was here. Please forgive me. I'm sorry. It, it's okay. Okay, thank you. I'll just take my leave. Um, no, wait. 
can I talk to you about something? Uh, can we go in? Is, is it about Kelvin? Let's go in. Thank you. Eh? Yeah. Mm -hmm. God bless you. Thank you. Hi. Let me go back to the kitchen. I'll join you soon. Yeah. God bless you. Huh? Are you expecting anybody? No, but let me check. Mm. Be careful, oh, um, please. So this is what this girl has been enjoying in this house, all alone. Hi! My brother's money. My brother's money has finished. Hi! But thank God I came. My wife again in my presence. Rita, why did you open gate for these two? Eh? These people are here for a mission. It is you that is here for a mission. You people should go back to the village. This, so this is your mission, right? Chicken. Cosmo. My bag no. is already inside. In case you have forgotten, come back to the village. Okay. Amaka, let's go inside. Eh? Go inside. Go where? Eh? She's eating. Eh? You are saying she's eating? Is it food that brought us here? Let's go inside. Go where? Because I have one also. Get out of the way. My bag is already inside you. Get out. Your mouth is just running. Back, 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 back. If you have any strength. Oh, yeah, leave the way now. I will leave. you. I will run into you. You and your wife should go back to the village. I will run into you. You run into me. I will run into you. Run into into me, you. run into me. Oh, God. What is going on here? What is all this? Why did you allow this fool to come here? Uh-uh. What is she doing? Leave the road, though. I will. I will run into you. Run into me, Vita. People should stop this now. Stop it. Our bag is already inside, so we must go in. Let your you go for it. Don't worry. Don't worry. I know what to do. Yo, 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 yo. Why is the dinner taking much time? I tell you. And why is Rita still cooking by this time of the night? Eh? Huh? I'm seriously famished. Okay. Mm -hmm. You know what? Let me go into the kitchen and find out what she's doing. Better. Check. Ah, Rita, what is the meaning of this nonsense? Huh? The meaning of what? Excuse you. Ah, excuse what? Where is the food that you said you were preparing for us? Look, look at the table bare, empty. I never said I was preparing any dinner for you people. Huh? I am just having my dinner. What? Look, look, look. If this is a joke, Rita, stop it. 
that go inside that kitchen and prepare dinner for two of us. Ah. There is nothing in the house. Wait. Are you trying to tell me that we will go to sleep on empty stomach? I did not know that you both were coming. Yeah. I don't understand this. Hey, Ruta. Why are you bothering yourself on that trip? Eh? If both of them are hungry, let them go out and get something to eat. After all, they're leaving this house tomorrow. Eh? In your dreams. You're Lizzie. not going anywhere. Lizzie! Why are you this wicked? You are, you are so wicked! Rita, you think I'm not aware that my brother left a lot of money in this house Too for us to take off ourselves? Bia, yeah. go and give us money so that my wife and I can go out and buy fast food to eat this night. Diko, I don't understand. what don't you understand? I don't understand. Oh, you think I'm not aware? You think I'm not aware that my brother left billions of dollars, naira and other currencies for us to enjoy ourselves before he died? Is that what? Oh God. Ah, Peter. You know you're such a foolish man. Hmm? Honestly, it's only a foolish man that will be banking on another man's wealth. <laughs> Don't even go there. Don't you dare insult, insult my husband before Back me. keep quiet. I've respected you enough. See, you dare not insult my husband before me. Hey, my boss, I don't what will you do? You what know now. We are leaving tomorrow. Don't bother yourself. In your dreams. We are not going anywhere. Look, you dare not try this nonsense. No. Let me tell you. This is my brother's house. My inheritance as the senior man in charge right now. You you go back to your husband's house. Don't you have a husband? Ah? You and your wife must leave this house tomorrow. That is what I have said. In your Whether you like it or not. Let me not tell you. If you don't stop this nonsense, eh? God in heaven. Why am I mentioning God? Devil will receive you. I'm telling you, you will burn in hell if you try that nonsense again. Oh, you think it's like the car, the car thing that I, I didn't say anything. Let tomorrow come. Yes, let it come. Let it come. You will see what I'll do to you. I Peter! 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 You are leaving this house tomorrow. You are the I one are I will go out, out tomorrow. I will not come. Rita! Come on! Take this woman to leave. Because you have Take this woman to leave. Okay, you will see what I'll do to you. Please stop! How can you reap what you did not sow? How can you claim what does not belong to you? Hey, greediness first, then destruction follows. Come out your eye of a waiting, no be your owner. Evil people everywhere. Hey, wicked people everywhere. They're trolling like hungry wolves. Attacking the innocent by evil people everywhere. Who is there? And I said, Who is there? But that doesn't sound like a friend. Oh, don't you understand simple English? Huh? Good, good day, ma'am. I'm, I'm sorry, I, I think I, I, I think you're wrong about this. Uh, can I help you? I'm sorry, I think I made a mistake. See, next time, you have to take it easy whenever you are knocking on someone's gate. Did you hear me? Mm -hmm. Just look at the gate, you know, it's very, very expensive. You cannot get it, you cannot buy it. Look at the building very well. You cannot build it. Nonsense. What did I do now? Why did I show her the, the address? What am I going to do now? Oh, ah, Zara! What am I going to do now? But that lady was not sure. Yo 
can force ourselves to the river But cannot force it to drink You can fight within your powers But what will be, will be You cannot break A bond that is so strong A bond built in true love A bond built in true love Cause no matter what no matter the fight and the obstacles, what we be will be. What we be will be. Me too. I'm just coming from your house. From my house? Yes. And you get my son away for five days now. Oh. He was right. And I was so worried about you. And your phone has been off. I got robbed. I'm not happy with your darling. I see her. I'm not looking for anybody. I'm not looking for anywhere. I'm not hey, looking for uh, Are you on drugs? Are you mad? Okay, you can go. Just give us a I'm not looking for anywhere. I understand. You can still go. No, I hey, I'm not looking for anywhere. Are you on drugs? Are you high? Are you high? What are you doing? I'll wait out for my. What? Oh, okay. Do you want to enjoy? No, no, no. What will No, no, no. You know, I'm going to let you go. So, 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 move, move. Huh? Yeah, this child, move. Hello? I'm going to tell you now. Eh? My eyes! You all die. You know what I'm going to have to Yes, I went back there the second time and she keeps saying some things. Oh. That's not true. I told Kate I was going to my father's house. Why would she lie to you? You did? Yes. Okay, it's okay. Come on. Let me take you home. I really spent a lot of money to build all this. I think what I will do is to bring my family down here so that we start living in this house. Because very soon, Rita will get married. And I and my family will be the one living in this house. This will now be my property, my inheritance. Hi! 
Ah. Eliza, I was looking all over for you. Why, why are you looking all over for me? Am I missing? The key to the kitchen, let me have it. What key and what kitchen are you talking about? Ah. What kind of question is that? How many kitchens do we have in this house? I'm asking you for the key to the kitchen in my house. My house. Whose house? My house. In Ezoshi. Are you a thief? How will you call this house your house? Is it yours? Please give me the... Look, my wife wants to prepare food for me. Give me the key so that we can open the kitchen and prepare food. Oh, you're hungry. Your wife wants to prepare food. If your wife wants to give you food, let her go out there and buy food that you want to eat. i give it to you. Like and... seriously? Yes. No, 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 no. You, you are now the one to determine where my wife should prepare food for me. She should not go outside and buy food to come and give me where we can prepare food in my own kitchen. Let me have the key. Let me have the key, Eliza. Come and take it now. Oh? I should come and take it? Mm -hmm. Nah. I'm ready to go. So give me the key to the kitchen. <laughs> eh, it is the key I'm trying to collect from her, but you know, this woman is so stubborn. She has collected the key, locked the key, she collected the key. She doesn't want to release it. Why now? I don't understand. No, because with our key. What uh, give me the key to your kitchen. father's house. Is, 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 is this your husband's house? Eh? Uh, go to your husband's house. I should go to my husband's house. Is this your house? It is my house. Collect. Nebiko, Let me have the key. key. Collect the key. I, eh? Look, I will run from you. Eh? Let me have the key. Collect the key from Go. Oh, yeah, because Peter, that key. Peter, Peter. 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 Check, check here. Peter. What? I, I, look, my, I, will, my, my, my I will put my hand down. I will put my hand down. Hey, no! Go, 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 go. Let me have it. Yeah. Ooh, ooh, I, hey. How can you rape what you did not so? How can you claim what does not belong to you? Hey. Greediness first, then destruction follows. Come out your eye of a waiting to be your owner. Sir. Uh -huh. How are you? Good, sir. Uncle, good afternoon. Ah, uh, Richard, you're welcome. Kelvin, yeah. he's my uncle. Uncle Peter. Oh. Uncle Peter. Uh -huh. Meet Kelvin, my fiancé. Huh? Nice to meet you, sir. Did you say fiancé? Yes, sir. Okay. Baby, let's go inside. Oh, okay. <laughs> That young man that came in with uh, Why are you asking me? Huh? Am I Rita? Is that young man that came you? Get out. I know why I'm asking you. Because I don't want any imposter in this house. So it is me, Peter, that wants imposter in the house, is it not? Let me tell you. My Oyoko Peter is looking at all of you. Particularly you. I know your plans. Don't worry. I'm watching. Peter. 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 Uh -huh. I better do something now. Because I don't want them to take me on a race. Yeah, Peter. Peter. So this is where they've been hiding. She said, I'm so disappointed at Kelvin. So Kevin actually left his house to come stay here. His mother must hear about it. He must tell his mother about it. Hello, Mom. Mom, I've seen where they've been hiding. Yes, I'm standing in front of the compound now. Ma? I should go home just like that. Come on. Okay, ma.
don't understand. Why are all these people here? I don't know. That's what I'm trying to find out. Maybe you just have to be very careful. I do not like any of them. That's my uncle and my auntie. I don't care who they are. You just have to watch what you eat in this house. I mean, eat only what you cook in this house. For me, I'm not afraid of anything. Is it not your same uncle that took your father's car from you and chased you out of the house? <laughs> He's the one. Leave. I see desperation in their eyes. Be careful with these people. What else can they do? After sending me out of my own father's house in the village, what else can they possibly do? They might still do it again. They've done it before. There is no way I am letting anyone intimidate me here. If that's what you mean, no. Babe, all I'm trying to say is this, please. These people I'm seeing here are vampires. I do not trust them. I have to find out why they are here. See, this is the car they came with. See this fine car? This is your brother's car. Uh, what do you mean this is my brother's car? This car belongs to your late brother, Chief Michael. It's one of his cars. Rita just gave it to her boyfriend. Yes. Hey! Oh, this woman, this woman. You see, this is your software. Why didn't I think about it? You are very correct, though. Mm -hmm. You know me. Hey. Smart. Brand. Have a better. Chai! <laughs> come here, come here, come here. <laughs> <laughs> you know me now. <laughs> <laughs> this one, This one enters. Yeah. <laughs> it's like that. <laughs> Look at my brother. This one, you are so excited. What is happening? Ah, uh, Lisa. You won't understand what my, my wife just told me now. You won't believe it. What is it? Do you know that this car belongs to our brother, our little brother? Bam! I said it! Do you know I suspected that even before your wife said it? You did? <laughs> because when I saw this car, I, I, I used to know Kenya Jafuzo. You know? I, 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 I know this car belongs to my little brother. Hey. Rita has a lot to explain to me. I am with you on this one. Rita must explain to us. <laughs> my brother's car. Okay. Bye. Bye. Where are you? Hey, it's you know, my car. Ah! My car. Put your car. Put your car. Why, why, she... why are you shouting? Put eh? your car. Anyone you see your car. Anyone you see your I car. Don't understand. This one is for me. How? Just imagine me inside the car. How it will fit me. Who took the other one away? Because can leave Ooh, Why did they allow them to, to leave this compound with that car? What would you have done? Amaka! What would you have done? See, Amaka! No, no, no! I shouldn't have allowed them to drive the car away! This man is useless, senseless, and stupid. What kind of a man did I marry? Eh? Hi! Ha! Amaka, what is the problem? Why are you always like this? Why do you keep on disgracing yourself always? Why? Disgracing myself, Kwa? What have I done again? Eh? You, you were there when I said... No, 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 when you said what? Must you expose everything? Must you tell your sister that the car belongs to Chief? You want to go to Uche? You mean I shouldn't have told her? Hey! 
Hey, when I saw that I told her, you are a complete disappointment. Huh? I regret having you as a husband. Uh, Makani, what happened with you? No, 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 no. Makani, that's, that, that's an insult. I will not take it from you. After all, nobody is above mistakes now. Ah, uh, nobody is above mistakes now. A fool at 40 is a fool forever. Shut your shame. Shame on you. Uh, I'm telling you that you insulted me. You're asking for an insult. insult. Yeah. What's the problem? I'm telling you that you insulted me. You are adding insult on, on top of injury. Ah, what's wrong? Look, I'm the one that married you. Need you. But wait to you. She has a point. Too. Oh, this is my head self. Eh? What is wrong with me? How can my wife be putting this matter than me now? Oh, you forgot. How can you wait? What you did not so how can you blame what does not belong to you? Peter, are you sure she's going to come out? <laughs> Is that a question? It's not necessary. If she doesn't come out, eh, I will go in there and bundle her out. Um, let me go and call her. Oh, just wait. Yes. Why did you keep us waiting? Oh, sorry. I was having my bath. She's here now. Let her sit. Sit down, baby. Is everything all right? How can everything be all right? What kind of stupid question you're asking us. How can everything be all right? Huh? So, if not that that young man brought my brother's car to this place, we wouldn't have known that you've dashed it out to a total stranger. Huh? Which car are you talking about? Last I checked, you and your wife took the only car my father left behind. Who oh, you are lying, don't be brilliant. Which only car? You think we don't know that my brother had fleet of cars? Fleet! And you hated them? Please. Please. What exactly are you talking about? You see, there's no need for long arguments. Hmm? Rita, we are here to discuss about our brother's rights. But before we do that, I want you to call that young boy, your boyfriend. Tell him to return my brother's car. Immediately. I still do not seem to understand what you people are saying. I don't. The car that my friend came here with this afternoon is his car. Liar. Oh. You are a big liar. Rita, don't get me angry. Don't get me angry. Uh, angry. Uncle, I should be the one saying don't get me angry. What's all that? Ah, do you even know the guy you're talking about? Do you know who he is? We don't care to know who he is. I don't care. Just tell him to return the car. That's all. Auntie, mm? even you? For the first time, I am going to ask three of you this. What have you come here to do? Mm. You dare not ask me such question in my brother's house. Mohen and Maggie, just one girl like you. Um. Rita, all you are saying is total rubbish, utter nonsense. Now let me warn you, if you don't return that car, that my car that you gave to your boyfriend, if you don't return that car today, you will see the other side of three of us. <laughs> are you hearing me? Maka, let's go. <laughs> What? Is that what I came here to do? Evil people everywhere. Hey, wicked people everywhere. They're trolling like.
like hungry wolves Attacking the innocent But evil people everywhere Wicked people everywhere So be careful who to trust Hello babe Yeah, how are you today? Hope you're good. What? My mother did what? Oh my god. Okay, okay, babe. I'm 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 on my way. Yeah, I'm coming. I'm on my way. What? Sarah forget this place. She thinks she can come here and disgrace me. Kate must have done it. But she could not tell Kelvin where I was when he was looking for me. But she lied to him. Kate is against him. She's against him. Come in. Rita. Rita. I want you to tell me the truth. I promise Peter and his wife will not lie about it. What are you talking about? I'm talking about the car. Your boyfriend came to this house with me. Is it my brother's? Excuse me, Auntie. I have had enough of these insults. How can you claim another man's car to be my late father's car? I'm sick and tired of these insults. Enough of them. Okay. I thought you could trust me to open up to my gates. Yes, you don't want to open up to me. I'm good. Hmm? Okay. Destruction follows. Come out your eye for waiting to be your owner. Evil people everywhere. Hey, wicked people everywhere. Patrolling like hungry wolves. Attacking the innocent. Boy, evil people everywhere. Mom. Kelvin. What is this harlot doing here? Mom, please. This should be the last time you call my woman names. Let this madness stop. Kelvin, you open your mouth and call your mother a mad woman because of this rat? Mom, I never called you a mad woman. I didn't say that. You did. You did, Kelvin. You said this thing you brought here that is causing problem between mother and son. She's going to suffer for it. You will suffer for it. Mom, this woman here is the love of my life. I love her with all my blood. Mm. I love her with my life. Please, mm. please, let this nonsense stop. Kevin, just shut up. Yes, I said shut up. Mm. How can you be such a fool to utter such nonsense before your mother? Your mother clearly wants the best for you, but no. You want to destroy... I stop it. You want to destroy your life with this whore. Just look at her. <laughs> Shameless thing. You cannot even trust the man you claim to love. I bet you on one thing, he'll never marry you. Because I know him like me, Batman. Can you, can you, you, can you imagine? Hey! Hold it. Hold it right there. And how, ah, how can, hey, how can you, you dare? Calvin, stop it. Stop it! Don't dare me. Take this thing out of here. Mama, we'll try it. This is my house, so I decide who stays and who goes. Mm. 
And the next time you do this, for the love of my life, I am going to throw caution into the wind. And, and what? Do not allow me to curse you on the day you were born. I am your mother. Take this thing out of this. She place. goes nowhere. It's over between us. Where? She goes nowhere. She goes nowhere. I'm hey! Not going anywhere. Let me tell you. If you do not, like I said, take this thing out of my sight right now, I'll kill her and nothing will happen. Mom, she has to leave this house. I'm not going anywhere. Hey, save it. Go and pack the things and leave this place. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Who are you? Hey! You can force a house to the river, but cannot force it to drink. You can fight within your powers, but what will be will be. You cannot break a bond that is so strong. Hmm. Zara, I have told you to stop crying. Stop crying. Come on. Okay. I want you to take me to that girl's place. I want to see her. To do what? I want to see her face to face. That girl that is causing trouble. Let her look me in the eye. Mama, well, that's not necessary. If you must help in this matter, the person you should talk to is Kelvin. No. Mama, that girl needs to be dealt with. Seriously. Oh, that girl has inflicted so much pain on me. All you have to do is to take me there. Let me see her. And I will settle this course. That's all I ask. You need to deal with that girl. Mommy, you need to deal with that girl. Mommy, she's bent on taking my man away from me. She will never. <laughs> it will never happen. Never. Let's go inside. Let me get you food. Drinks. Oh, no, I don't want to eat anything. You are not hungry. You said you have not eaten anything since yesterday, and you say you are not hungry. Eh? I don't want to eat. I'm not hungry. <laughs> Zara. Zara, eat food, though. Eat food. Also, it's real. Uh -huh. Yeah? You are not hungry. You don't want to eat. And you want to go and fight. Mm. Ah, what I will do to her again tomorrow? I will give her the biggest shock of her life. Yes, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> On empty stomach. You have not eaten anything. You want to go and fight. On empty stomach. By the time she blows you, you will somersault. Like a dead body. You better go in and eat now. You're crying. You have not even started the fight. You're crying already. <laughs> you're you're old. Mommy, I'm leaving I'm leaving with you. <laughs> you better give me the girl. You better give me that girl. <laughs>
just imagine. Special one for you. <laughs> Your favorite. <laughs> ah, where is the food? Are you asking me? Where is the food I kept here? You said you set the table. You're asking me the food you kept here. Yes. I, I said two plates of food for us. Ah. So the food suddenly developed wings and flew away or what? Who removed the food from here? Um, maybe it's your niece. Let's ask her. You're right too. Rita! 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 <laughs> Rita! Come, let's go. Rita! Mm -hmm. Where is the food? What is it? Who took the food I kept here? Mm. Two plates of food. I don't know. What do you mean you don't know? Food that my wife cooked and kept here. Well prepared for me to eat, I'm hungry. You are telling me you don't know. Where is my food? Uncle, why would I take your food? No, why? Maybe it's your sister. Oh my God, go, 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 go. Let's go and look for Eliza. Eliza! Give me time. Eliza! Eliza! I want to see her. Prostitute? Yes, the prostitute that lives here. I want there to see her. There is no prostitute. Who, who are you looking for? Rita lives in this place. You, you call me. This is the house. Rita lives here. I'm sure. Who are you looking for? Rita lives here. I'm sure. Let's go. 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 let us Oh, did your husband snatch her yet? Yeah. Very good. But, uh, so you are the one? Eh? You are the one who has burned him to allow my daughter to marry her husband of her? Excuse me, who are you? You dare ask me such stupid question. You dare ask me such stupid question. Do you think I've come here to play with you? How many times have you been warned to stay away from where my daughter's husband is? How many times? I'm asking you. As old as you are, you barged into my house. To shout at me? Of course, sure. You know what? You go out of my house this minute. You say? You what did you say? Barge into my house, shouting at me. Out! She said you should get out. Get, get out! Hey, get hey, out! Hey, what is going get on? Out. There? This your daughter is a whore, a cult. Tell her to leave my daughter's husband. Peter, I don't what know. are you doing here? What are you doing here? I don't know. What is the name of it? What are you people doing here? Mom, what's the problem? What are you doing here? Wait. Did she call you mom? Yes. She's your daughter? Da yes, she's my daughter. That small Chisela now, you know, you know. Hey! Chisela, this is the twin sister. Hey, what? Yeah, don't. It's a lie. Yeah. Peter, stop. You have started! You have started! What is it? You people are confusing us. What is going on here? Can somebody explain? Yeah. She knows they have no joke. Hey! Peter! Hey! 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 Yes! Come, come on, Mom. What's happening? Both of them are twins. Yeah. They are sisters. No hey. way. 
This mm -hmm. husband snatcher can never be my sister, mom. What you don't know is bigger than you. She's your twin sister. Well, you never told me I had a sister. She is a rare. What you don't know is bigger than you. She's your sister. Mom. Yes. This is not why we are here. And this girl here who has inflicted a lot of pain on me will never be my sister. She said, come on. Come on! Come on! This is a different story we are seeing all together. Are you serious about this? Yes, Mom. My mother <laughs> even confirmed that she is my twin. But Mom, how can such a person be my twin? Someone who took what belongs to me and cost me so much pain. How? I can't believe this. I can't believe it. I can't believe it. Carolyn, <laughs> are you aware that you're dating two sisters? Twins are that. What are you talking about and who are you talking about? I am talking about Rita and Zara. What sort of joke is this? Rita and Zara, twin sisters? How? Mom, she might be my sister. But this fight is not yet over until she leaves my man for me. How come this information? Where did you get that from? She went with her mother to Rita's place. And Rita's uncle and Zara's mother recognized each other. Rita and Sarah, twin sisters. Twins? This must be a joke. <laughs> joke. Serious joke of the century. Arena, could you please tell us why you called for this meeting? Thank you, Peter. And I also want to thank everybody sitting here. I wanted this meeting because I wanted Peter and Lizzie to bear me witness as to what I have to tell my two debtors what transpired between the father and I. Of what choice is that, man? No matter what you say here today, it is not going to change my notion about the one who snatched my husband from me. Jesus, shut up. Shut up. What you don't know is bigger than you. I've always told you that. So keep quiet. I am your mother. When I speak, you keep quiet. Um, please, go ahead. My husband and I were living happily in a one-bedroom apartment. He was an artisan then. Three years after I gave birth to this children, things suddenly changed after I gave birth to the twins. Sarah! Rita! Are you supposed to come and take me? Say like a phone. Say like a phone. Yeah. What did you do? Come here. My baby, yeah. Good girls. These my girls. The girls are doing well. Get to the finish of the track. And you finish this one, I'll add the one. Yes? Um, um, um. Arena, go in and, and, and get me something to eat. I, I am very, very hungry. Am I not talking to someone? I said, go inside and get me something to quench my thirst. I'm, I'm very, very hungry. Michael. You too. Arena. Arena. I will not repeat myself again. Go inside. Get me something to quench my thirst. Uh, Zara, Rita. Go oh, go inside. I have to wait for me. Hey, hold it. Hold it. Go inside and wait for me. Yeah? Come on, come and meet inside. Yeah? Good girls. Michael. I will not get you anything to eat until you tell me where exactly you are coming from. Are you coming? I am not. I. I am coming to you. I am. I am coming to you. 
Now, where are you coming from? I, I, I went to the chemist to treat myself. Arena, which chemist are you talking about? Eh, liar! Which chemist are you talking about? Eh? Shut up your mouth, liar! Which chemist are you talking about? Do you think I have not been told about the affairs you're having in this street? Affairs? Mikey, what are you saying? Please, please stop it. What are you saying? More one word from you, I will break your jaw. Eh? Now get inside and get me something to eat. I'm late for work. You, you, you don't expect me to keep quiet while you are accusing me. Eh? What are you saying? I did not do anything. I just went to the chemist to treat myself. Look, look, look at my face. Arena, you are not talking back at me because you go about seeing other men, right? Eh? Let me tell you, as far as I'm concerned, this marriage is over. Go inside and pack your things. I said go inside and pack your things. Fine, if you want me to leave, I will leave. And if I leave this house, you will never see me again. You think I am bluffing, right? I am not going back on my word. I will go and call my sister Elizabeth and Peter to come and bear witness to what I am telling you now. Now get inside and pack your things. I said get inside and pack your things. Not do anything. Go, 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 get inside and pack your things. Go. It's almost 12 noon. And my husband has not been home since yesterday. What is all this? Who is deceiving this man? Who is deceiving my husband? Of course. Hmm? Arena, you will not kill me in this house. You will not kill me in this house, Arena. Arena, I will kill you in this house. You are not going to kill me because my mother did not kill my father. Hmm? Yes! Yes! Uh -uh. You will not kill me in this house! You will not! Tommy, what is going on? Where have you been? Don't you ever call me your darling again because I am not. Do you think I don't know who your darlings are? Eh? Besides, what, what are you still doing in this house? Let me tell you, I cannot continue to live in my own house with a prostitute. Never. Never. Oh, eh, eh, Danny, what are you talking about now? Eh? I thought your relatives have already settled this issue. Why are you still bringing it up? And you accepted everything, no? Never. I have not accepted anything. Let me tell I have not accepted anything. If you and my relative have settled it, I have not settled with you. I have not settled with you. If by tomorrow morning, you have not packed your things, I mean the rags you have in this house, and get out of my house, I will kill you. I will kill you. And by the way, while living, take Zara alongside with you. Because I am, I am having this feeling that she, she's going to be like you. Yes, like mother, like daughter. If you do not leave my house after tomorrow, I will kill you. Eh? Make sure, I, 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 you, I make sure you, you leave this house by tomorrow. Yes, I will kill you and bury you, and nobody will hear anything. I, 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 I will not warn you again. 
I, 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 I will kill you. I, you, you. You think I am joking? You think I am joking? How can Arena choose to kill me before my daddy in my own house? Why? Arena, this house will not contain the vote of us. Never. Never. Arena, never. It will not. It, you know you know me now. You, you know me. It will not work. Never. So I left with Zara as he said. I didn't want to tell anybody. Because I know that if I told you people, you will not allow me to go. I was afraid you might kill me one day. So I left because I had made up my mind already. But before I left, I put a mark on Ruta's neck so that I can identify her in future. Arena, our brother told me that you ran away with his daughter without his consent. Mm -hmm. I thank God you knew about everything I said to you. Your brother asked me to take Zara away, and I knew he meant it. But mom, how come you never mentioned this to me? Instead, you lied about my father. I did not lie. I didn't know how to tell you. Because I don't want you to live with it. Hmm. <clears throat> well, um, we've heard all you've said, okay? The truth of the matter is that uh, I was aware, I was actually uh, a witness to what transpired, okay? Uh, no matter what happened in the past, the important thing now is that we are back to reunite the family, okay? So you're welcome. Thank you very much, Peter. Uh, there's still one more thing. Which is? When I left, I noticed I was telling more spread lines. Huh? Yes. And the young man sitting here is the result of that pregnancy. Here! Huh? Mom! Here! Eh? He looks like Neo. <laughs> eh? He is a Neo. Look at you. Idiot. Peter. Peter! Meh! I like that out. Meh! Peter! Man. That is the only way I will accept her as my sister. What exactly are you talking about, Sarah? What I'm saying is, Rita has to leave Kelvin for me if she wants me to take her as my sister. Simple. What are you saying? No, I want to know exactly what you mean. Rita is your own blood. Your sister. You want to throw her away because of a man? You want a man to come in between you and your own blood? Does it look like I care about blood? Or emotions? I don't care! Zara, I think you're allowing your emotion to take control of you. Uh -uh. We are talking about peace here. Come on. Ekene, I am very sure you heard the condition for the peace you're talking about, right? Yes. Rita destroyed the relationship I built for years, thereby causing me emotional trauma. So she has to leave Kelvin for me. And that's it! Mama, you need to talk to Rita. I observe she behaves more matured. I. I think she might accept to sacrifice her love for peace to me. What of Kelvin? Who does not want to leave Rita alone? What do we do? Mama, let's talk to Rita first and see what the outcome will become. This one's head here is spinning. Are you sure Rita's own will not spin it? Mama, forget about Zara. Let's talk to Rita first. You are sure? Yes. Okay. It's alright. Peter. Sir. Eriri Geri. I mean, when will you be wise in this life? Get on Bobo. Can we get with sense? Which kind of stupid question is that? Eh? Why are you insulting me this afternoon? What kind of insult is this? You angry, eh? You're supposed to listen whenever I talk to you. Don't you know that this is a plot for that boy to inherit the properties that belong to you? Imaro! Is that why you should insult me? What's wrong with you? 
You're supposed to tell me so that I think about it. Uh -uh. Let me think. Uh, so are you telling me that uh, Arena lied to us? What kind of stupid question is that? Uh -uh, you are insulting me again. She was never pregnant for your brother. If she's telling the truth, where is the proof? Let her prove it. I think you are right too. I think you are making a lot of sense here. Hi. Let me tell you. Arena made that plan. Immediately she found out that your brother left behind a big wealth. Similar incidents happened in our village when I was small. You see that boy? He is an imposter. He went to a rape where he did not sell. Hey! Everything you said is correct. Yes. Um, what should I do now? Good. That was one of the best questions you've ever asked. Stop insulting me now. You <laughs> are ah, ah, talking reasonably here. Yeah, you, are, you are insulting me. Tell me, what, you what should I do? Give me respect because I'm the one that always brings out the plan. Who executes it? <laughs> <laughs> Look at you. Please talk to me. Talk to me. Okay. What should I do? First thing is this. You see this revelation. Your sister must not know about it. Look, I don't like the way you insult me at every given opportunity. Eh? If you have sense, you know what to do. I should not be the one to remind you. <laughs> hey! Hey! What was that? Honey? Okay, what? Hmm. You know, I forgot to tell you. Let's go to the room. The bedroom. I want to show you something. Something interesting. We may have started the thing already sweating. <laughs> <laughs> this Amaka has a dubious character. I know they were discussing something. The moment they saw me, they kept quiet. They don't want me to know what they are discussing. No problem. I must find out. That was it. I was surprised to know that I had a brother. Have you spoken with Sarah? I mean, one on one ever since then about this whole issue? No. She left immediately after the meeting. So, what was her mood? I mean, was she happy? Was she excited? I really do not know. But the most important thing is that we both know who we are and i want to believe that she is going to stop giving us headache and allow us get married peacefully and you think i will allow that hmm? i once told you that no one lives where he or she did not stop zara has been with my son for years now so now that you have found out you know what to do mom do you have to interrupt our discussion you expect me to keep quiet and allow her to say all the rubbish in this house. The earlier she gets that into her stupid skull, the better for all of us. Is she be listening to our discussion? You know, I have respected your mother enough. The next time she talks to me in this manner, I will take it from her. It's okay. You know how my mother talks. Hmm? So chill. The thing I don't get is why she hates me for no reason. She keeps talking about how long Zara has been with you. Ignoring the fact that you took my virginity. You don't really need to bother yourself about all this. You already know my standing in all this. I do. But 
She needs to stop forcing Zara on you. That's my point. But what will be, will be, you cannot break. I wonder is so. That is why I sent for you. I want peace to reign. Biko, Zara is your sister. Whatever she has is yours. Mom is right. Honestly, I'm very happy to have you as my sister. So let's, let's use this opportunity to make things right. Yes. Thank you. The truth is, if there's anyone to let go between Zara and I, it should be Zara. Mom, have you seen it? Have you seen that she's not even ready for the piece you people are talking about? This woman here is not even ready for the piece you people are talking about. Oh, lost but found sister. You want me, Zara, to leave a man I have already fixed my wedding date with? <laughs> are you even serious? Hey, hey, what is wrong with you? What's your problem? From this woman here is my problem. Tell her to leave my man for me. Kevin is mine, come what may. Zara, what, what is it now? Can you just let things be? No way, can I? I have received a lot of insult from this woman. Who is she to come in, to come here and tell me to leave my man for her? She has not said so. She did, mom. She did. I heard her clearly. Yeah. If it is peace that you people are talking about, just forget about it. Because it is never going to work between me and this whore here. How dare you? Enough! Now listen to me. If you are not ready for the peace that we're talking about, then get ready for the opposite. Rita! 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 R Rita! She slaps me! Uh -huh. yeah, keep quiet! Shut it up! Shut your mouth! If not, I will slap you back! <laughs> the war has just begun! Yeah, wait! She slaps me! Yes! She slaps me! And I will slap you another way! Okay! I'm off here! Bye bye, my dear. Bye 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 you are here. You are listening to her. She was singing. She left and you're asking me questions. I don't know you. Guy, Alpha. Our client offered 50,000 for the job. 50,000? Yeah. What is 50k? Nah, yeah. Ah, that money is too small. But no worry. No worry. No worry. No worry. I price 100,000. Mm -hmm. You understand? I price 100. Let's see. She will understand. Okay. She will ah. complete her. Yes, yes, yes. Mm -hmm. I, I, don't, go. I don't send them the accounts. Ah, it will not be small work, man. Wait, wait, wait. Let's send her. Hello? Hello? You don't need to fear. I don't tell you, say, don't need to wait in the now. The account go, I don't send you. View. Just credit on the 100,000. Yeah. Send us a picture. By the end of tomorrow. <laughs> People don't wear black, they work out for streets. Yeah, <laughs> you understand? You know, girl, you know, girl, just send us the picture for WhatsApp. Well, before that, credit us. That's the main thing. Uh -huh. All right, we'll wait. Jogger, move. movement, movement. Ah, this is not a small job. What would they do now? Nah? I don't know if you're anything now. Rita, tell us why you called for this meeting and please be brief because as you can see my wife is not here she's upstairs waiting for me so be fast about it ah ah must you talk about your wife all the time can't you talk with that mention namaka's name what is your problem eh? what is your problem what is your problem who what called problem? you could can you say go on Jan. am i the one who told you not to have a husband ah ah the reason i called for this meeting is because of my mother and my siblings. I'd like to know if there's anything I need to do 
to bring back my mother, especially back to her husband's house. Eh? Rita, bring who back to your family? Eh? I was thinking you called this meeting for us to discuss how we are going to equitably distribute my late brother's wealth. And you are here talking about your mother that was divorced by my late brother decades ago. Eh? Can you hear yourself? What are you trying to say? What he's trying to say is that neither your mother nor your siblings has a place in this house. You know, no? Because my brother, your father, divorced your mother long ago. My mother never said that. And I am telling you now. Yes, she's telling you. Because you see this house, I inherited it from my late brother. And I'm not going to share it with anybody. Ha, ah, Peter! You are what? My inheritance. Uh, uh, Nupo no are you talking to me? Peter, Nupo, which house is your inheritance? Yes, this house. You are a liar. Because Chief Michael, my brother, is about one name. He willed this house to me. Forget that I allow you and your wife to stay in this house. You know why? I know why. So don't, don't be too relaxed. Yeah. Nonsense. Did you hear that? Steve. Oh, something is wrong with you. Auntie? Hmm? Was that why you poisoned their food? Yeah? Yeah? What did you say? You remember that night you were looking for your dinner? Yeah. I took it. I took it away because it was poisoned. Eliza, is that true? This girl has taken Kai Kai. She don't know what she's saying. I don't know what she's talking about. Was it in your dream? Eh? Me? How can I do such a thing? Rita, why? I knew you were going to deny it. I had it in the You look at it. Here. Let me see. Hey! Hey! Oh. Eliza. So you wanted to kill my wife and I? So that you can take over my inheritance, eh? You have failed! Hey! So, this was what happened. Hey! This was what happened that day. Amaka! 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 Yeah, 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 yeah. Hey! Yeah, what is it? Come and see. You remember that food we were looking for? Mm. Eh? Mm. We were looking for who took the food from that table. It was written that took it away. I knew it. <laughs> I told you that she's the one. Hey, don't be too fast. Rita saved us. We would have been dead by now. This devil poisoned our food. She wanted to kill us. She poisoned our food so that she can take over our inheritance. Look it's at it. True. Come and look at it. Rita recorded it. Look. Hey! Eliza! How are you? So this is how you are. If we talk, your mouth will be doing pre 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 So you want to kill us? Look eh? a woman eh? I would have pieces you here now. What do you mean not to touch a woman? Is it not your wife that your father told you not to beat? This is your sister. Beat her. Oh, so it's only in my hands that you have power. You beat her. I she not your fellow woman. Beat her. Okay. Don't, don't, don't okay, say. You see what I would do. Oh yeah, go I'll ahead. Just give you a chance. Give you a chance. Okay, I'm back. Yeah. Evil people everywhere. Wicked woman. You call yourself a sister. But you are a killer. We can, you must leave this house today. Today you must go. Where are you? Move, move, move. Move, go to please. Move, move. 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 Move,
kill all of us. Do you want to kill all of us? Pick up, one, one, one. get out of there. You sold my husband's car a lot. Eight the money. On what are you doing? Get out of Fukushima. Pick up, come here. Go to Fukushima. You know we can sort this out. Eh? Please, you're my brother. Eh? Eh? That is what I'm sorting out now. Sorting out means you leaving this house. Madam, leave my house. Remember, I'm your sister. You're my brother. Yes. Yeah? Please, forgive me. Forgive your sister. Oh, it's like you don't know me. Look, I'm like Mopo. The more you beg, the more he gets angry. The more you beg me, the more I grow angry. In fact, I'm angrier now. Leave Now, Mopo. Leave her. Leave her. As you have been, look at my eyes. I'm getting angrier now. Leave her. Nah, you're wasting time. You don't want to go. Mr. Badero, I will call the police for you now. Okay, I'm not going to wait. She doesn't want to leave. Now, I give you two options. One is for you to leave now and have your peace. The second one is, I will call the police and I will lock you up. You know your charges. One, conspiracy to kill husband and wife. Two, conspiracy to put poison inside your food. Three, conspiracy for Rita catching you in poisoning them. Four, conspiracy to murder. Look, I will, I, the count charges and you now leave. It's too much. Choose one. I'm not calling the police. Where is the phone? Well, give me the phone. Don't call the police. Hmm? I will go. Okay. Oh, yeah, go. You're talking like a reasonable human being. Oh, yeah. Get out from here. Why are you looking at me like this? I am go now. I don't understand. Go, go, go. go. Go, go, go. You 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 Attacking the innocent Boy, Evil people everywhere Wicked people everywhere So be careful Who to trust We don't have this whole place to ourselves ah, eh? mm -hmm. This is the opportunity we have been looking for mm -hmm. got go. got go. We will now cool down Relax Execute the plan you know that I am the master planner and you are the chief executioner. Executioner. <laughs> you see, Rita has helped us. Ah, she I, just made this easier, easier for, for us. us. You want go go? Eh? Go I will prepare a special card. He, he's not just that special card, the other special. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. He's not taking his call. Zara. Mom? What is it? Are you alright? Um, Excuse me, please. I need to take this. Yeah, 
You can force us to the river, but cannot force it to drink. You can fight within your powers, but what will be will be. You cannot break a bond that is so strong. A bond built in true love. A bond built in true love. Cause no matter what, no matter the fight, and the obstacles, what we be will be. 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 No matter the challenges and obstructions. Can find them lost. I think they've taken to another route. I think I have to call the police. Um, hello? I'm sorry. I'm sorry if I offended you, Jesus. Let me go. Shut up. I'm having pains. My whole body is failing me. Please, my heart is pain. Shut up! You still get mad to talk, Abby? As you do like this now, so eh? what you would they wait, eh? Now I lot. As you will receive, I'm mean, what you go here for your head now. Oto, oto. Oto, oto. Go collect. This one will give you for her, then I'm testing the gun. Why? Mm -hmm. They make noise, bro. They make noise. Mm -hmm. They make noise. Bro. Never, you never start, sir. Please. I, I'm sorry, please. What did I do? You make noise, man. Please! If you move, I'll shoot you. If you move, I'll shoot you. Okay. Don't look back. Go! Go! Continue move. Move! I've been thinking. About what? Do you know what we are going to do, eh? We are going to sell this house. Yes. When we sell it, the money we generate from it, we use it and travel abroad, settle down and flex ourselves. How do we go about it? We don't know anyone in this city. After you be priding yourself that you are a planner, master planner, and executioner. Eh? Look, all I need to do is just look for an agent. The agent will sell it. That's all. We we'll collect our money. Okay. Mr. Planner, now, do you have the papers to this house? Ijiya. When we get to the bridge, we'll cross it. <laughs> ah. I like that statement. <laughs> when we get to the bridge, we'll we will cross, cross it. it. Hi. Simple. Come, Maka. Eh? Oh, Maka. Eh? Eh? Please call me. Rita. Asaha. Hello? No, I, I'm the uncle. What? How? Where? When? Okay, okay. Hey, what happened? Who was that? He, he said that uh, Rita was shot this afternoon by kidnappers. Eh? Is she dead? Uh, he didn't quite say. Uh, but I'm sure she's dead. Hey! Hey! Another match. Another match. Hey! Rita is a gunner. Hey! Our plans are falling into place. Oh, oh my God, no. I don't understand you. How can you say our plans are falling into a place where somebody just died? Hi. My, my niece, oh. Hi. You see it? If I talk now, you will say that I have talked. With Lizzie, out of the scene. Now, Rita is a corner. You got to go? Aruna and the rest. We say no thank you. Everything is falling into place for our good. <laughs> falling into okay. place. For this is my good. head. This is my head. I don't know what is wrong with it. Eh? Before I start thinking, you're already there. Fast, fast. This is your packaging, eh? your computer software. Eh? It's something else. Oh. Ah! Look, come, come, come. See, 
I'm not in the mood. I'm in the mood. Let's go inside. Every time you'll be in the mood. To think fast, you will not think. Like this, eh? I'll put one in the ah. mood. Okay, to put it in uh, the let's mood. Let's go. Ah. Let's, nah, I will be the one to go. Yeah. Where are you going? Where are you going? Mommy, I have an emergency. I'll be back by next week. And you did not tell me anything about the trap. Mommy, that is why it is called an emergency. When I come back next week, we'll talk about it. Please, I have to go. Sandra, Sandra, where are you going? Move. Move. Kelly, what are you doing here? Is she the one? Yes, sir. She's the one, sir. I'll sit down uh, on the floor. Please arrest her. She's the one. What are they talking about? Officer, I don't know these people. I don't know them. I have not done anything. I, 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 I didn't do anything. Young lady, you are under arrest for the offense of kidnapping and other criminal offenses. For your own good, you have every right to remain silent for whatever you say or do to be used against you in the court of law. Why are you arresting me? I, I, I have not done anything. I don't, I don't know what the people they, 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 they told you for. Who are you? Well, wow, that is talking, you are talking. I didn't do anything. I didn't, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't do anything. Eh? What has she done? Mom, when I come back, I will let you know. Officer, yeah. please do your work. I didn't do anything. I didn't, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't know these people. I don't know these people. I don't know them. What has she done? What has she done? I didn't do anything. Move. 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 I didn't do anything. I didn't do anything. Um, Olga, the house is okay. Hmm? Yes, the house is okay. What do you mean by the house is okay? House is okay. You went around the house, you checked the exterior, you came in here, looked at inside. This fantastic house, you are just saying, the, the, the house is okay. Eh? Look, any buyer you will bring to this house will rush it. Okay, fine. Huh? What is the price? The uh, price? Yeah. Uh, excuse me for a second. Five hundred million. But that's too much now. Let me tell you three hundred million. And what do you mean by three hundred million? Eh? If you miss this opportunity now, eh? if you miss it, you are told. Hey, I can't even blame you. It's because you don't know how much common sense costs at the market. Yeah, don't insult me and make my best visit or you don't insult me. Five hundred million, that is what you are talking about. Okay now. Okay. Who is on it? I don't know. Let me go and check. Let go. See, 500 million. Not I less. You know. Instead, you add. Don't let the man be on. No, not here. Let me check. Uh -huh. So, agent. What is going on? Uh, uh, what is going on? Huh? It's just the price now. So, um, bring 500 million now. Uh -uh. Okay, that amount is too much now. Uh -uh. Why, why are you saying it's too much? Do you know how much my brother has spent? Sorry. Do you know how much I spent in building this house? Eh? I, I spent billions of dollars building this house. You're talking, say, 500 is too much. 500 million. Well, that one is too much. How can it be too much? There is a problem. Problem? What is going soon. Rita and the crime scene, they are here. They are here. Oga, oh, now, what is going on? Uh, uh, relax now, we're having some tete a tete. Okay, fine. What is your last price? Right? What are you pricing? Ah. <laughs> Rita, you're welcome. No, I, I was just uh, telling him um, the price for the shoes yes. he wanted to buy from me. He you know, did. I said you so. He did some shoes and he's the one that. Okay, what are you saying now? I thought you wanted to sell the house. So why are you now diverting the discussion to something else? Will you keep quiet? You wanted to sell house. You wanted to sell my father's house? I don't know. Don't mind him, oh. Why are you like this? You thought I was dead. Mwah. 
and you want tell to sell my brother's property. Sell which house? This fine house that my brother left for me. No, I won't sell it to. Why are you lying? How can I sell the house that my brother left for me? Mm -hmm. yeah, this fine house? No, I won't sell it to. Mm -hmm. uh, okay, if that's the case, I'm not buying anymore. Okay. Who wanted to sell before, sir? Buying what? The house that I inherited, I want to sell. sell. You see, uh, it was my wife that was luring me. That's the truth. I didn't want to sell the house. So she's the one. She, she says she's a computer software. So she gives me all the bad bad things. She puts a lot of bad bad things in my head. So yes, at the point she, I was confused. My friend thought that you're a member of my family. What's your problem? Chief. Who, 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 who is telling you what? Don't you have friends? If I tell you to jump inside the uh, uh, fire, you will jump inside Yeah, the fire. you're not Eve. He jumped inside fire. Uh, when Eve gave Adam apple, was Adam able to resist you? So this is how you how are. How can I resist you? This is how you are. Huh? Well, 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 that's the one are. that is implanting you, bad, bad things. You are the one. Okay, please, uh, please. I'm sorry. Oh, yeah, jump, jump inside fire now. I won't, I won't say anything. That was all that happened. My late husband, Kevin, wanted to have my uncle and his wife arrested. But I pleaded with him to please forgive them. After two months, Kelvin and I got married and we were blessed with two sets of twins. Your mother and her twin brother were the first set. Mm. You can pass a house to the river, but cannot force it to drink. You can fight within your powers, but what will be, will be. You cannot break a bond that is so strong. A bond built in true love. A bond built in true love. Cause no matter what, no matter the fight, the end.